Hey everybody, we're live from the HPG booth at the PPA AI Expo 2024. And uh, when I say live, I mean live. We're literally live streaming this event. So everything we do right now, we didn't, we can't rehearse it. Uh, we might flub, we might say some things a little off, but it's okay because you're gonna see all the great things HPG has to offer in 2024. And to tell more about that, I've got our CRO, Trina Bicknell here. Trina, what's going on this year? Thank you, Nick. Good morning, good morning. So I am so excited this year, and I know I say that every year, but I am the most excited this year because we have the largest product launch we have ever had in new product and so many amazing sustainable products. Sustainable is really our word for this show. So please come down and, and the folks that are at the show come and look at our brand new products. But the thing that I am the most excited about is that we are doing this live stream all day long. We will be live streaming from the booth. So for the folks that actually couldn't come or they maybe were delayed from weather, there's been a lot of that, that they are actually going to be able to be with us on the booth and feel like they are here. So I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited for the show. I am too. It's going to be great. Thank you so much, Trina. Um, you're welcome. So without further ado, let's see what is new at HPG in our booth 2216 here at PPI Expo. And to start things off, we're gonna kick it off with Org Audio, one of our amazing HPG brands. And to tell us all about the new stuff is my main man, Spencer. Spencer, what's up? What's new at Org Audio this year? Promo Bobby here, and I just gotta say, sustainability just got sexy. All right, the name this is the a live stream, folks, so. <laughs> the name of the game here, all jokes aside, is our new Terratone collection, which does have sustainability in mind. It's environmentally responsible with quality that you can count on, all the things that you trust and know about Origadio. We've embedded into the Terratone collection. The thought behind the Terratone collection is really using earthy tones that give a grounded appearance in the larger product scope that we have here. A main point, one product in my short time is gonna be this three watt speaker, the Terratone speaker with recycled plastic and recycled leather. So again, you have quality you can count on, recycled sustainability in mind, and then just a killer product. This is the Terratone speaker, three watts here. Another great thing about this collection is it's uh, modular, right, Spencer? So you can build kits because all the boxes and packaging are built in a size and shape that can fit together easily. Yeah, in terms of the modular packaging, I think it's great for cross-sell, upsell, diagonal sell, whatever selling options that you do have. If you sell one product, you can kit it with something else because your client is gonna like it. You also show that you have continuity in your gift giving program. If you sell one thing from the Terratone collection, you don't wanna just next year, just give something completely random, right? You wanna just bridge from the same exact collection. So modular packaging helps you get more sales at the end of the day, right? I agree, modular is the way. Now, I don't know what that means. Do you have anything else here you wanna show us? It looks like, what's this? What, is this a Tiki torch, Spencer? This one's pretty freaky. This is our Tiki Speaky. That's literally the name of the product. It's the Tiki Speaky. So the Tiki Speaky is gonna be a wireless Bluetooth speaker that looks like a Tiki torch, like the ones that you have in your backyard. It does illuminate when you turn it on. The branding's on the front, fire glaze dome. And it does have a stake that you put into the ground so you can enjoy all your favorite tunes or maybe your podcast from my intellectuals out there into the ground. Lastly, it does pair together with another like-minded Tiki speaker for a surround sound-like experience. So it makes you say, Wowza. It makes me feel like saying aloha, actually. Aloha. aloha and goodbye. Thanks, Spencer. This is Org Audio. We've got so many new other new things, but we also don't have all the time in the world. And speaking of time, it's time for Mel with Hub Pen. Hey, Mel, what's up? What's new in the world of Hub Pen? Oh, my gosh. Well, we are celebrating a special birthday this year. Hub turns 70 years Whoa. old. So it's going to be a year-long celebration and some great promos headed your way. I do want to call out a couple of things. This year, Hub is the official pen sponsor of PPAI. We are handing out our Gemini comfort with our new infinity decoration so we're making a big splash of that here at the booth as you can see we've got samples everywhere i do want to make another call out on the topic of sustainability where are we sustainability <laughs> We are looking at the are we looking here? Sonata. There we go. There we go. So um, this is our Sonata Eco. It is made of recycled craft paper. Um, and we have several other options of, in the line that we're going to be featuring and calling out while we're here. As we know, sustainability is a big topic. Um, I also want to point out our new TerraCycle box that we're featuring. Um, this is a receptacle to ensure that your um, writing instruments, when the ink is all gone, they are not um going out 
including the world. We're going to have a, a safe uh, place for those to go and get repurposed. This company, TerraCycle, actually takes the pens and pencils and markers, breaks them down and makes like furniture out of them, right? Yeah, they make furniture. Um, they make, you know, dog beds. Yeah, <laughs> dog beds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so these pens aren't going into the landfill. This is a huge initiative from Hub and from HPG, right, Mel? It is. It certainly is. Um, thanks for stopping by from home. <laughs> yeah, thanks, everyone. And please stay tuned because there's going to be some quirky, fun stuff. Thanks, Mel. You're the best. I'm getting hungry already, and it's first thing in the morning. I'm always hungry. So it's a good thing I arrived here at Batch and Bodega, and I have the lovely Alyssa with me to talk about some new things that we've launched from Batch. What's yes. what's new at Batch, Alyssa? Uh, we've got a lot of new stuff going at Batch. So Batch and Bodega is our kidding brand where we bring in small mom and pop batch kit snacks, and we bring them together with our branded swag. So this year in 2024, one of the things we really want to do is pack more punch with more branded swag in the kits. Yeah. So I'm going to talk about a couple. This one is called your office outfitter where it's actually a nice room drop. And guess what, guys? Yes, that is a Stanley Cup. So we will actually, oh, Nicholas is dropping that on the ground. I blew it. My, my granola bar. Um, but again, we're going to brand it on the back side. You get your um, desktop and vibra pen and, of course, the hydrate coffee. Give a little bit of punch in the afternoon when you get a little tired, which might be me later today. Um, another great room drop is, is this one as well. You're going to put it in a, re -zip, a reusable zip bag from Beacon, branded. And then again, another hydrate. You get these great new sugar spot candies, which Sharon's going to talk about next, lip balm and some mints. So Can I, oh. We got plenty of snacks in this yeah. booth, plenty of snacks. Um, also, oh, the festival goer. So again, we're going to hit some concerts this season, go to some sporting events. Um, you've got your lip balm. This was a top seller last year. It's our mini fan, great imprint area, um, your clips. So it's great for your backpack, your salted snacks, your, your great little fruit bites. Again, lip balm. We love our lip balm here at HBG. Um, and then it's also our double wall um, drink cup. Again, so you can put your um, 16 ounce slim in there and then off to the race as you go. But again, what we're changing up, we've always had these beautiful branded boxes, as you can see, but we're now putting a lot more of our kit items actually in the printed premium. So the kit is going to actually be in the bags um, in addition to some of our original big sellers that are also still branded in boxes. Yeah. So this is Batch and Bodega. This is great. It's important to be intentional with kidding, right? Yes. So we know that people want to eat and use these things instead of just throwing a bunch of stuff in a bag. Yeah. It's got to be intentional. It's got to be great. Yeah. And I'm intentionally high-fiving you, you and saying thank you. I love you too. Thanks for watching. Yay. Yay. That's Batch and Bodega, everybody. All right. Look at this. Wait a second. This is going to be trippy. That's us live on the on the, on the screen. So there's a little bit of a lag. It'll be like going back in time or something. I don't know. That might be fun. Fun. Did I say fun? Fun. fun. This <laughs> is the sweetest spot in this entire booth. Just wanted to say that. Now, listen, I'm going to watch. Don't put anything in your pocket. Welcome to Sugar Spot. Oh, I have to say, no, I I'm sorry. What we have is 26 new amazing candy options like pineapples Ooh. gummies now listen if you have something going this is my favorite oh sugar lips mm -hmm. and remember all full color labels on the taster packs or what? you said sugar lips sugar you're calling lips. me sugar lips no, that's not no, appropriate sweet lips but no oh, okay here, shh, shh. here take those put those in your pocket but we have them in taster packs we also do them in the small jars the large jars and guess what else we do what else we have kits now, this one is my favorite. This is Goldilocks and the three bears. There are three different kinds of gummy yes, bears in here. That's so cute. So you have your grapefruit Ooh. bears. You have your strawberry banana bears. And, of course, Pop and Prosecco. So those are your Goldilocks. But then we have Take Flight. Now, all of these kits, some of them you can put in boxes or you can put them in the bags. Now, Take Flight is, of course, what? Butterflies. Look oh. at those butterflies. Okay, and the branding goes on the sack as well as on the jars. So before I let you go and give him some more candy, we're going to show you the oh-so-sweet box. Ooh. So you see these here? These nine, nine beautiful jars. And these are hefty too, by the way. This is, yeah. a lot, this is a lot of candy, even for a guy like me. Even for a guy like you who's going to check him before he leaves. So in Check here, my insulin. This is what comes in here, these jars. So when they're sitting in here, they see the branding immediately. And it's our top selling, our newest brands. This is, oh, 
so sweet. Oh, so sweet. Oh, this so is the most sweet. colorful part of our booth, maybe. It is. And we eat with our eyes, right, Sharon? But Correct. also, I think we brand with our eyes. When you see your brand's colors and, 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 and people get happy, they get excited. We have gluten-free options. We have kosher options all up and down the booth. So come see us. All right. Well, I'm going to go all around the okay. corner, and have I'll see you later. Snack. Nuts, I love you. Okay. And bye. <laughs> okay, bye. All right. We're moving right along. We're right on time. We're going to keep the live stream live. Hey, there's Gerard. Hey, Gerard. How's it going? <laughs> all right. Oh, I just... I just got a whiff. It's not candy. It's something like a spa-like scent that I just got. Ooh, and is it your perfume, Mel, or could it be the Mixie booth? No, it's the euphoria of the Mixie booth. And Mixie is HPG's personal care destination. In fact, what we like to say today is mirror, mirror on the wall. What is the coolest lip balm after all? It is the new Pucker and Pout sustainable lip balm made of recycled packaging. This is going to be our number one item this year. We know it. It comes in a mini. It comes in a regular size and of course if you just like good old-fashioned lip moisturizer we have a whole other selection as well hey mel what does that mean recycled pack like so in other words this is made of recycled packaging but what happens when you're finished with the lip balm yeah so this is going to easily biodegrade so it's not going to go into you know the trash and collect with all that other plastic awesome it's also great because your lip balm is not going to leak in this container oh leaky lip balm is a, is a big problem facing yeah. our society so Yep. So, um, well, um, what else do you need from me? Mary? I'm wondering about this. Is this like, is this something I can, can I get a pedicure here? What, what do I do at this yeah, actually, lovely so station? This is our little self-care station. Um, so Nick is uh, clearly uh, turning this into his boudoir. We can, uh, we can get you a manicure with our, our clippers. Check this out. Um, check out a variety of our lip care products. I feel like I could just sit here and just feel like a pampered princess, you know, and I'll, and I'll be happy. Um, you know what? We want to keep it stress-free. So yeah. I want to add that we have a whole new selection of stress balls. My personal favorite right here is our confetti crunch. Can you hear that? Can you hear that? It's like squishing a Rice crispy treat in your hand. A little ASMR. A little ASMR um, to get, you know, get out all the tension, the excitement. It's a great desk item. Something you want to keep around. Oh, and it has glitter inside. Glitter. What's this? Ooh, this is the Mala Cool uh, stress ball. Um, as you can tell, all of our stress balls come in a beautiful uh, retail style packaging with a little peek through window, um, so you can see all of the coolness that is inside each one of these. They're that looks so satisfying. Highly yeah. addicting. Yeah. This is awesome. I, I don't know. I'm a fidgeter anyway, so th this makes me very happy. It does. It smells good in here. It yeah. might be you, but I think it's the Mixie Booth, too. You know what? We're busy people. We're juggling a lot of balls in the air. You might as well make them stress balls. Yeah, let's de-stress. And you know what? We're doing at HPG is de-stressing the whole experience for you at home because you don't have to be in Vegas around all these amazing people. You can watch from home all day while we live stream the HPG booth. All right, moving right along. Did you miss me? We have a familiar face. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hey, Sharon. We're back again, but with a little bit of a different take. Beacon. We have some great new products, home, office, tools, and if we shoot over there, we'll see some new totes. But this seems to be the big one. This is Brightworks. Now, it has a little light here, and it folds flat, and it's a 30-piece tool set. Okay, and then if you're doing any detailed work, you just hit the button. Of course, Sharon can't do that now because it's live. There we go. And then you can work on something important like maybe, I don't know, making jewelry. Who knows? Making Ikea furniture. Ikea for, oh yeah, that's a hard one. So that's our bright works. Now, we always do a lot of flashlights. Yeah. So all of these are rechargeable. That's right, if you wanna make a flashlight eco-friendly, you recharge it. So these are all rechargeable. It's called the Renew. And this is the latest rechargeable which is a lantern, kind of like a vintage lantern, charges up, great piece, nice metal on top to hang, so it's very sturdy. And then let's go over here, coasters. We have our latest and greatest is, that's right, a vinyl record. How is that a record? Is it is a vinyl, vinyl. record. All right. So 
you get full collar standard. We have a ton of different like types a record of coaster. So when I'm rocking out with, with my beverages, Correct. set it on. I've got my logo there. I'll never forget with a coaster. So a lot of outdoor items, rain gauges, and of course this is when Nick makes a mess at the desk. What? This is a bamboo sweeper. Magnetic. So think about it two ways. You could use it in the kitchen if you're a baker. You can use it in, you know, the garage if you're just, I don't know. A making, candlestick maker? A candlestick maker. You know, you're sawing something. You have koi food, whatever it may be. So koi really food. Quick, hurry up. Hurry up. All right, yeah, okay. we got to get going. Okay. These are all made out of recycled water bottles. See that little tag? Get in there and look at that tag. So this is based on our most popular fashion tote. That's your Lululemon. But we're also making it in a cargo carrier. We're making it in the large tote. Have to show you that. And last but not least, don't forget our leather. It's amazing. So all full grain. This is buffalo hide. This is buffalo hide as well. So, but we also have other kinds. So now I'm going to let you go all on right. your way. I got to go because we have a 930 segment okay. with Mel go. later. I love you, Sharon, but we got more to do. Let's go this way really quickly because I want to talk to Zachy Boy. Yes, sir. Zach's got a beautiful booth for BCG in here. Zach, what's new at BCG or what's happening so, here? What do you do? Well, number one at BCG is emblematics. And with that emblematics is the service. If you haven't dealt with BCG already, you've got to try us out. You're going to be so refreshed by how we take that classic product, the lapel pins, your keychains, your coins. Your virtuals are going to come within an hour or two. Production is super quick. Pricing is super competitive. It's everything you want on that simple, awesome product. Yeah. Now, lapel pins, when you're doing them, what we love to do is put it on a card. You can do a set of two, you can do a set of four, a single pin on a card. You can even turn that into a really nice deluxe set, something really awesome like this here. So lapel pins, guys, they're they're awesome. It's the only product you're gonna take from your backpack to your cork board, to your jacket, to your hat, it's going everywhere. Now, I wanna talk to you, <clears throat> sorry, I'm gonna talk to you about a few of our new products. So the layered wood coaster, this one here, is all the rage and you can see all these different things you can do with it we love that stadium take because you get all that amazing detail in but check out this map of canada you can do stuff like this here and it's honestly without limits you can do something let's say like a restaurant with some cars parked in front of it you could do a state with a flag raised off it there's endless ideas and again contact bcg our team will do all that artwork for you you let us know what you want to work on amazing Amazing stuff. Zach, I hate to do this. I know we have a lot of yes. stuff. I have to keep going down the booth, but we're going to have a segment with Zach later on in the show today. He's scheduled up, so we're going to keep it live. You're the man. I'm, I love you. Let's go this way. We want to talk about our neighbors to the north. Uh, not neighbors, our partners. This is HPG North over here. This is Debco. You guys all know Debco, especially hopefully our Canadian customers who are, who are signed in right now. And look who we have here. This is Kate Plummer, who's a director of sales at Debco, a new member of our team. Are you excited to be here? I'm very excited to be here. It's uh, the scale of this and everything's really cool. And I'm looking around going like, well, these, we have good products this year. So we do. We got it going on. Well, speaking of new products, what, what would you like to show us today from Debco? We got lots. So I'm going to start with our, one of our drinkware items. This bottle right here, the display. This is called our Phoenix Tumbler. It is 80% recycled stainless steel. So it's one of those like durable, lovely. You want to do something that's good for the environment. This is the one that you want to go with. Keeps everything hot and cold for ages. That's the bottle you want. Yeah. So we got our Phoenix Tumbler rising from the ashes. You know, we put some thought. I see, I see what you did there. Thank you. Thank you. We also have our double wall drinkware, our glassware. Ooh, double wall glassware. Double wall glassware. Great. This is called a part of our brewski line. Again, we actually have drinkware. It's kind of good. You need a drinkware item. We got it. We got it in glass. We got it in Triton. We got it in stainless steel. We got it in ceramic. You this want is ceramic? We got ceramic. We got ceramic. It's good. It's good. <laughs> we also have our beautiful toteware. Again, recycled cotton, recycled plastic. But the one I'm really excited to show you is part of our Glacier line. Yeah. Glacier Peak. Retail inspired brand. Durable. Made from tarpaulin material. This one's great. Throw everything in there. You need this feels substantial. This, this is nice. This is like it's heavy It's a good duty. one. Yeah. This one is going to take you to every single event you need to go to. You need to go to a barbecue. I do. Put it in there. Yeah. You need to go to the beach. Yep. You put it in there. You, everything in there. Holds like, I think it's like 50 pounds. Wow. Yeah. We've tested it. We've thrown in there. You got to do your tools. You got to go fix something. Yeah. Right there. You're all set. All right. So we got that. Guys, let's consider Debco HPG North because you have everything HPG wide. 
and you have everything just in life. You're the best, Kate. Thank you. I try. All right. But moving right along. <sighs> this is a big booth, so it takes us a little bit. But now we're into our newest, the newest member of HPG Brands, which is Evans. What's going on? And, and Evans, uh, this is Alex Sims, by the way, director of sales over at Evans. Hello, everybody. Looking and uh, I, we don't have enough time to tell tell the folks about all the amazing all the stuff. stuff. And you'll be on stage later, but what's yeah. tell them the highlights here. So number one, don't forget those four major product categories, bags, healthcare, housewares, drinkware. Our fastest growing product category right now, killing it with drinkware. Look at the display there. Isn't that cool? Come by Whoa. and see us from the polisher bottles all the way down to the stainless steel, the new 40 ounce tumbler, the Alaskan, one of our best selling pieces. Real quick, let's go sit, check out some of the new stuff. Oh, let's check out over here this this beautiful wall here, the Evans wall. We've got some new product. By the way, new product for us, this is the Yuma. If you like Lululemon, you want to see what's trending, the bag is going to be awesome. So we supplement this, can do it on both sides. Don't, don't forget about that. I like Lululemon. I do too. Our crossbody bag performed so well this last year. So what we do, we've now introduced it into clear. So this is now the clear crossbody in addition to the clear tote as well too. So we have those do two products. Feel the texture of this. Ooh, soft. Yeah, very nice travel uh, silicone based product for that. We've gotten into tools. We're gonna talk more about that later. Okay. But come by and see us if you're here at the booth. If not, you can check all of our, our new product launch brochures on our website. This is loaded. All of our new products are loaded on there as well too. Bottom line, keep thinking about Evans. Nick, thank you so much. I'm always going to think about Evans, and then I'm going to just like go down the elevator. And um, we're going to go around this way though, because we got to see what's new at Best. You guys know Best because Best says yes. They're going to always take care of anything you need. And here's the Best. This is Jacqueline. Hi, Jacqueline. What's new at Best? Okay, let me take you over here. So I'm going to lead off with our brand new uh, Eco Freak collection. So we've got two different options, and what this is is our first ever recycled can coolie. Um, the cool thing about it is um, it fits on every style can. So as you can see, this is all the same coolie stretched across any type of drink that you have. I'm really excited. It's made from ocean-bound plastic. So Hey, know, wait. That's the founder of the, the Eco Freak. That guy is the one who made these. So yeah, this wow. we were just talking about the, uh, the Eco Freak over here. Oh, hey, here it is right here on a coffee cup. That looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Um, this thing it stretches. It fits on cans, beer bottles, anything at all. Uh, just forms to whatever you put it onto, and it's made from plastic off the coast of Mexico or Haiti, and in America, in North Carolina. Yeah, and you invented it. You I have did. part. Yeah. yeah. Uh, right. is, I, I don't know. I love you. I watch all your videos. I'm a little. I'm fanboying. Oh, that's oh, nice. Yeah. That's so nice. That's warmer than I thought it was. Gonna be. I'm, I'm. I'm a sweaty <laughs> animal. So uh, apologies. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. All right. Uh, we're gonna move on through best here and see a couple other. Of really cool things here. What what do we got next, Jack? I'm going to talk about the cappy also. So this product here, um, you slip it on your your can holder or your can tab this way to pop it, and then the cool thing is you put it on this way, turn it around, and it actually closes and seals your can. So, oh wow! Yeah, super cool. So option. like dirt doesn't get in the can or like anything dirt, else that might fall. Debris, anything. And it won't spill when the can tips over. It won't. Exactly. It actually keeps the fizz in a little bit longer too. Uh, we've got the cappy coolie combo here. So another great piece. And then a recycled uh, Neo Green Coolie is what we're calling this. So it's made from uh, recycled materials, neoprene can coolie. This one's coming soon, available in about a month. So look out for that. Um, awesome. Coming up next, let's talk about some drinkware. Um, so we're getting really into the decoration at best. Um, as you can see here, getting close there. Um, really cool decorating capabilities, um, full color wrap all the way around from top to bottom. That's beautiful. Yeah. So um, we've also got this 40 ounce tumbler here. I always like to highlight that. Mega tumbler is what we call it. It's got the nice carry handle. It's got a laser engraved option there. So cool. That's, That's amazing. Cool. Thank you, Jacqueline. Yeah, we'll see you later. All right, you can sense a theme here, sustainability throughout our whole booth. We're really, um, oh. oh, 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 excuse me. But I guess it's a good opportunity to talk about handstands with Kimberly here. Hey, Kim. Hey guys, nice to, for you guys to join today. Yeah, what's new at handstands? So let's talk about journals. Journals are a new addition here at handstands. And like Nick said, touching on the eco, we have added three different eco element options here. I love to talk about the harvest. This is made from fruit, fruit fibers. That's hard to say, fruit fibers. And you get this beautiful belly band that we could also customize. So branding on the journal, as well as that belly band. 
And then the quarry. So this is really unique. This has that stone paper, which is waterproof, stain resistant. So this is great for people that work out in the field that need to have be able to take notes, but have that um, element of not having issues with water and weather. Yeah, functional. And it's also made with like ground stone. So there's a sustainability story there where we're not... Absolutely. Stone dust isn't going to this. Yeah, no stone unturned. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. <laughs> um, next, we combined two of our top sellers, our recycled desk mat and our no wire mouse mat, and made the no wire recycled desk mat. What we love about this is branding real estate, but you also have a charger right on your desk. So keep your desk clean, keep it bright, keep it exciting. And this is recycled material. So again, you can feel good about what you're adding into your office. Fantastic. I love that. And you get this beautiful packaging. Oh, yeah. Look that's that. nice. Re uh, you retail, know, retail. the way people receive things sometimes is more important than what they're receiving. So with this nice retail packaging we do. Absolutely. Highly impactful. Yep. And you get that with all of handstands. And then lastly, I want to touch on the Harmony 3. Talking about beautiful packaging. Look at this nice gold element there. And the Harmony 3 is three in one. So you have this wireless charger. Let me show you that beautiful in front area there. It is also a speaker. It has that nice wood feel, so it's aesthetically pleasing, calming in the home. Wait a second. Just a second ago, you did this. Oh, the light changes when you touch it. That's right, Nick. <laughs> and then you pull this off, and you have a light. It's like a light bulb goes off with all the applications you can use for this. Oh, I love it. I love it. Thank you guys for stopping by. Alyssa, Thanks, you're the... Alyssa, that was... Kim. Why did I say Alyssa? <laughs> oh, I know why. Thank you, Kim. Yes. Let's move this way. We're scooching through the booth. Let's come back this way, Jeffrey. We're going to find Ben. So, all right, we're almost, uh, we're almost finished with the an initial booth walkthrough that we'll do for you guys. This is just kind of a teaser because later on, we're going to have little individual, more detailed segments about these new product drops. So you can get, uh, get your notepads out, get your stone journals out, and take notes. Uh, but right now, I want to—I want to—I just alluded to uh, one major theme we have this year, which is sustainability. And uh, I have you with us, our VP of Marketing, Ben Posse, who oh, it's coming out of the jungle here. Ben, what is this wall? What what are we doing here? What's good to know? Welcome everyone. Good to know is HBG's new way of talking about sustainability. Sometimes it's about recycled materials. Sometimes it's about fair trade or where it's coming from. And good to know is just our way of being more specific about what we mean by sustainable. So let me just talk you through some highlights. These are new products coming out right now. Mixy, beeswax, lip balm, loaded in the USA, blended in the USA, and now in a recycled craft container. This is a big deal. I also want to talk about ocean-bound plastic being turned into innovative beverage sleeves. You, I think you met Zach on the other side of the booth. This is a really big story. We have cornstarch tote bags, 100% cornstarch makes these tote bags. We have wood, beautiful ornaments. We have some pretty cool notebooks. This is a brand new category for handstands. You probably learned more about that, but we have upcycled leather. We have um, fruit fiber notebooks and our tarot cycle partnership I'm really excited about where we're taking pens that would be thrown away and we're turning them into useful goods like play, uh, playground schools, benches, you name it. Uh, TerraCycle is our new brand uh, brand partner for getting waste out of the landfill. So, and we also have food partners as well. Upcycled food, it's delicious, great brand story made in the USA as well. This is from Batson Bodega. So there's so much to choose from at HPG that does good and, and we're being more specific with goods to know. So look out for that this year. Thanks, Nick. Thanks, Ben. That's good to know. And this is goods to know. See, I'm trying to tie it together. I appreciate it. Pretty cool, right? I love it. Um, listen, that's that's a little sneak peek. That's a little like drizzle, a little salt bay on what our booth has to offer this year, or this this expo, I should say. We're just getting started. We are going to be going live all day, mainly from this stage, this HPG stage here. We're going to have new product segments. I got a lot of notes. I'm going to be interviewing people. You're going to love it. Please stay tuned with us. Uh, and uh, please get in the chat, too. I see some people are already uh, talking in there. Ask questions. We're going to uh, respond to these questions. We want to interact with you as much as we can. We love you. This is HPG 2024, and we'll be right back in just a few minutes.
Can I tape over your thing? I don't want to accidentally. It says it's, it's on the same setting.
be Kimberly here with us. Um, if you're watching earlier, we had a little sneak peek, but she's going to go more in depth about what's new at Handstands Promotional Products. And by the way, before Kimberly gets started, if you have questions, I'm watching the chat. So ask the questions. I'm going to make sure that uh, I'm answering the, any questions you have. Mm -hmm. And uh, with, without further ado, Kimberly, this looks exciting to me. I'm a, I'm a 45 year old man, but I'm, I'm a 10 year old boy inside right now. Bright colors, bold statements, in print real estate. So what we did this year is we took our top selling mouse pads, which is our new recycled desk mat that launched last year, as well as our no wire mouse mat and combined the two. So right here you have this beautiful recycled no wire desk mat. So you still get that gorgeous real estate for your imprint, nice little colorful bleed, but you also have a place where you can charge your phone. So this just keeps your, your workspace clean, bright, organized, and also gives you power for your phone while you're working away. What I love about this item is that it has that eco element. So if you're looking to increase your eco product this year, we have tons of offering over at Handstands. Which brings me to the next thing that we've launched this year, and that is our eco journal line. First, we're gonna talk about our quarry, which is made with um, ground up stone. So it is rock, paper. Rock, good? paper, scissors? Rock, paper, scissors. Stone, paper, boom. boom. Um, yes, yeah, so stone paper. This is great for companies that have people out in the field because this paper is water resistant, stain resistant. So if you're in and out of your car, you're out on a construction site, this is a great item for you. But if people are just looking for something unique and different, also another great item for you. And then we have our harvest line and we have three to four different sizes for each line. And this is made from fruit fiber. Try to say that fast. Um, so you have that nice eco line, great story, comes in this gorgeous belly band, and you got that nice full color imprint on the cover there. And last but not least is our Eco Scribe. This is recycled leather notebook. So this is gonna be that soft touch, beautiful feel, higher end. You slip off this belly band here, and you open that up, and you have that nice gold detail, place where you can store notes, business cards, you can stick in some, honestly, you could put a power bank in there and keep this charging while you work. And again, you get that nice full color process decoration on the outside. Yeah, sustainability is important, right, Kim? We're getting asked for these products from your end user, your clients, because they want a story, but they also want something that's less impactful on the earth. Absolutely. Um, and we believe in that. This, this industry is huge, but we can still make some great products uh, Absolutely. that meet those uh, CSR needs. Honestly, it is becoming more and more of a trend. It's a request. I know a lot of companies are trying to convert to eco by 2025. So yeah. we're hearing what you need and we're listening and we're creating product for that need. Yeah. And then uh, next. Kim, will you please? I'm sorry. Will I you know. tell me about this? Amazing. Again, the 10 year old boy in me gets so excited when I see this thing. It's an exciting item. So this is the Drifter. This is a fun remote control car that you can have branding all over your house. You want artwork in five different locations. You got it. You want a customized license plate with somebody's name. You got it. With one piece minimum, this is a perfect gift for that client that you're just looking for something a little different. And what also I love about this is the box that it comes in. You open this up and you have a little racetrack that you can launch that drifter off of. You get little cones that you can set up a racetrack and extra tires in case you blow one. And then this beautiful packaging that goes on top. Yeah, the drifter comes with a change of tires. So they're rubber tires and these slick ones. So when you're driving, it kind of slides around. It makes me really excited. And imagine um, someone giving this to like a CEO and it says, and it has their face on the hood. And it says, let's drive sales into 2024, right? Absolutely. And this is not an item that's just great for one person. It's great for households. I have two young children and they absolutely love this item. So it is just a feel good family product as well. I'm not a young children, but I feel good when I see the drifter. Uh, I beg to differ. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then last but not least, we have our Vava -va Vroom. So it comes in this beautiful packaging. Again, this is for people that are looking for something different, something unique. This is great for people that, um, like myself, I have two young children. My car is always a disaster. But with this, it makes it very easy. You turn it on, and you can just clean up as you go. Ooh. 
No more excuses for a messy car, which my husband really likes. So would you say this sucks or it doesn't suck? I don't know. It's a quandary. Get it? I'm sorry. Bad jokes. That is a <laughs> We're live, guys. <laughs> Nick, you're always quick with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But gorgeous packaging. Oop. We don't want to lose anything here. Yeah, bob, bob, room. But yeah, that's what's new with handstands. Any questions, let us know. All right. Uh, the, we do have a question from, uh, looks like Jeremy Laura Moore asked, um, journals, is standard embellishment include both the belly band and the cover imprint? So the standard imprint is going to be that nice full color that's going to be on the item itself. However, for an upgrade, we could customize the belly band. So you got that? We um, The standard imprint is on the journal. But we do offer a lot of custom upgrades. Yep, custom sleeves, custom be belly bands. Yeah. Let's see. Thank you, Jeremy, for asking. Yeah, that's a good question. That's a great question. In fact, Absolutely. while I have you up here, and you might not have it with us, we could show this as an example. People do want custom packaging. And our ca our packaging looks great, I think, at hand stands, very retail look. But maybe you need to get messaging out. Maybe you need to uh, have, have an event, and you want a really customized look. Mm -hmm. We can do belly bands on most of our products. Uh, custom belly bands at very low minimum order quantities. Yes, so. and so this is a great example. A lot of our standard packaging at Handstands and Orgadia comes with, if I can do this, a sleeve. Here. I, I got you. I think Thanks, there's a sticker Nick. right here that's uh, oh. holding it together. Nice and secure packaging. Yeah. So you can see right here, this packaging, you have the beautiful packaging inside, but it comes with a full decorated sleeve. What we could do is take out our standard packaging and do a custom imprinted sleeve on top of this. So they, when your client receives this, they know exactly where it came from, from the second they received the package. Yep, yep. All right. Um, oh, thanks, Maureen. Maureen says, this is awesome. Thank yes, you. Yes, thank HB you, Maureen. Hit. We appreciate that. She was talking probably mainly about you, but I hope, Maureen, you're talking about our big live stream because this is going to be going on all day. Yes. Uh, in the booth, booth 2216, if you're here. Uh, and if you're not here, thanks for joining us. Yes, thank you so much. Kim, is there anything else you want to leave these wonderful people with today? Grateful for you guys tuning in. We wish that you could be here in person, but I'm so glad that you tuned in and got to meet us and see us and happy that you were here. Excellent, excellent. All right, well, hang on real quick, Kim. So let me tell you guys watching, we're going to let Kim pack up and go. Mm -hmm. We're going to, um, in between all these segments, by the way, we're going to have little um, previews of the next group coming up. Uh, which will show you some of those new products that we'll be talking about. And we also might mix in a little commercials here and there, little fun videos that we've done just to keep things moving along. But every 30 minutes, we're going to have a new product selection from all of our 10 brands here at HPG. Uh, so stay with us, stay tuned, and we'll be back. Momentarily. When, when will we be back? We'll be back in probably 15, 20 minutes, 22 minutes to be exact. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you. And, and, and in case he leaves the camp, they leave the camera going, I'll be dancing and Kim will be dancing and we're dancing because this is so much fun. We're happy to be here. Yeah. Thanks everybody. Thank you. We'll be right back.
All right, we're back live. We're live. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you're enjoying them. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sitting here with us. I've got my main man, Don, here. He's going to talk about what's new at Evans, and there's a lot of new stuff. I'm going to go away because there's so much I can't be here with you, Don. It's just overwhelming. Nick, I've got it from here. I appreciate it. You got it from here. Great. I, I will it. come back, though. If you guys have questions, put them in the chat because once Don's got a fish, I'm going to come help answer these questions. We want to make sure all the questions are answered. Yes. We can answer any have question, fun. whether it's true or not. We'll see. So the first thing I want to do for you guys at home and give you kind of a feel for what's going on here. Like I can see it over the show floor. It's packed. It's busy. People are hugging and uh, staring at me, That's which is uncool. But um, weather's beautiful. Wish you were here. Maybe you'll be here next year. What I would do is give you a sense. I'll tell you, being here, this is Evan's first uh, little foray into our into the HPG biosphere. We're in, in the show booth with everyone. Uh, and there is a lot of energy, a lot of traffic. And a lot of new products. Uh, it's HPG's largest product launch ever across all the brands, and uh, we're very excited. So I want to touch on Evans with some new products and some uh, old faithfuls, of course. Uh, so you know Evans does things 
the four really core competencies and categories that we do with bags and drinkware, home and um, health. Start with um, talking about those four real quick. Let's talk about what we do with totes because you know we manufacture totes. Talk about imprint method here. We're gonna, this is going to be about a dye sublimation. So we're going to do dye sublimation on four bags available to you standard. Best selling uh, small tote. I call it the collateral tote. Great for catalogs like something here today. We have a shopping tote, which is your rectangular tote here. We have a grocery tote. Uh, two of these actually, then a, a larger grocery tote. The thing about this is, though, it allows you to bring, because this fabric, as you know, on non-woven totes is very difficult to screen print on, to do small lettering, QR codes, full color, uh, things like that, though we can do uh, heat press, but that gives you a small area. Here, what we're going to do is imprint the entire area for you. Then we're going to construct the bag for you. So it's not going to be a seam-to-seam -seam imprint method. This is going to be all across the panel. Then we're going to put the seams together. In this case, we've used white, but you have nine colors to choose from. So you can imprint the front. You can dye sub and or the back. And then your thread, your handles, your gussets will be one color. We have nine to choose from. Your standard blue, black, green, yellow, things like that. So uh, standard five-day production on this, 250-piece minimum. We've been doing this three or four months. Um, we'll... We're going to extend it out into the uh, to some other um, of the totes that we manufacture because you know we, we do manufacture 25 different totes. Uh, but dye sublimation will get you um, RGB colors, any color you, you can put on a piece of paper. We can put on this for you. The clarity, which you guys were here, I'm going to attempt. I'll put this over here. If they bring a camera shot in there, just the clarity you get, as you see here, just the lettering that you get. With images, I say QR codes. Um, so that's available for you. And that's kind of the newest thing that we're doing, the hottest thing that we're doing in totes and in bags. In totes, in bags, of course, for those of you who want to be um, in the Cool Kid Club or you sell to the Cool Code Club, the over the shoulder bag, this is out there. Lululemon has it. My wife has it from Athleta. It simply does this right over the shoulder, under the shoulder, on the back. Whatever. So we have this in. Uh, a gray, black, and a blue. It's the item number 8555, five, 8 and 35s, if you're carrying along, uh, following along at home. The 8560 is the clear version. Going into public stadiums, things like that. It goes over the shoulder, just like this, as you see here. A lot of people right here on the show wearing them. Big thing at retail. Uh, we're, these are, you're selling these uh, between five and six dollars. So this is the 85. Five five and the eight five six zero over the shoulder bag. Brand new for us at Evans. If you go on the website, we we do print the mini catalogs. We have a new product cat, uh, catalog that you can uh, download. Go through Zoom catalog. You can see everything I'm talking. We'll talk about everything here, but everything that's in the catalog that is new is in this catalog. And I believe I am going to be ninety percent sure from what I've heard and what I've seen. I believe everything is in stock. The one thing with Evans is if you go to the website and you search on and you go to the, I, the 8555, for example, if you see it on the website, it is in stock. It's not coming soon. It is in stock. Uh, and it is in the sample department. So if you want samples, that is available for you. So you can download this, and we have a little catalog section in the marketing. So you can see the, the new. If you want a new, a new products catalog, you've got it right now at, right at your uh, computer. So this is all the product categories have something new. As you see, we're here about eight pages here. There's some new writing instruments. Um, come over here, we'll show you the spinner. So we have the spinner pen. I know Hub carries a, few, a couple of these. We have one in plastic, one in aluminum. That's very cool. So a new, new writing instruments there. Make this place easy to work with. One thing, um, Evans is going into uh, tools. That's a new category for us. So we have tape measures. This is the, um, what is this? This is the 27, 25, 25 foot tape measure. Comes in a black and gray, comes in this yellow and black. We're also gonna introduce the um, 2825, which is the screwdriver that has the uh, Phillips head, pulls out, has the flathead on the other side, octagonal 
uh, clip in, slides right in. So these are available, and we have a six in one tool as well. So it's new for Evans, uh, going into a little different new category, but the way we figure if you're there, we have some more stuff for you to sell. So tools is a new category for us. Also, also in the bag, I showed you the over the bag and clear. I want to show you our, our, our tote. Uh, this is like, uh, as I mentioned earlier, with um, stadiums, going into baseball games, football games, uh, public areas want clear uh, bags for you to carry. This is great here. Uh, this is item number 8530. And with the trim comes in a black, a red, and a royal trim as well. For drinkware, here's what's new for drinkware. So I'm going to give you from the A to the Z. So it starts here with our 4744. As you can see here, this is the 40-ounce Expedition. Uh, we all know what it looks like. It looks very, very similar to. Works just as well. It is copper lined. So that gives you that ice, uh, that hot, cold performance. Uh, even on the box, it says 30 hours cold, 12 hours hot. So that gives you that uh, performance. The one cool thing about this that gives you high quality is the locking mechanism on the lid. I'll show you that. Like that locks in place. So if you want to take the straw out and you're jostling around, you might spill it. This has a closure here, turns right over the over the drinking opening. No spills. Goes right back here, locks in, screws on. You're ready to go. As you can see here, the straw, the slitted area in the gasket. $17.99 sells for this, all the way down to where we start. So we've introduced, so stainless steel drinkware is a big thing. So we introduced $10, $10 sell items, 12, 19, uh, the, this is $17.99. We've got um, $22. All the way, it starts here, sells for six, just under $6. This is the 20, this is the 4722. It's a 25 ounce single wall, single wall, um, a stainless steel uh, bottle. So the thing about this is um, what we introduced with our vibrant color, these are a high enamel finish. These, if you want to do a, a stainless steel bottle with full color imprinting, this is the one you want to go for. This very shiny, the, um, as you can see here, this just pops. What great um, color, uh, a great bottle to do full color printing on. So it comes in a, a bright red, uh, the, a bright blue, a green, and a black. The, the 47, this is a, this is a great piece. Uh, so you can sell someone full color drinkware, uh, full color stainless steel drinkware, sell it under $7, $7, around $7, $7 to $8. That is just, that's just a great place for people that, you know, don't, don't need performance. Maybe you want higher quantity and don't want to spend as much. So between here and here, we've got something every 50 cents for you. So put those over here. Do you want to talk about, uh, I know it's selling season. One thing uh, Evans is famous for, talk about catalogs because we don't print a catalog. We print many M-I-N-I -I catalogs. Uh, I brought the drinkware to show you. So we print categories. So our best-selling drinkware is going to be in a drinkware catalog. Our totes are going to be in a tote in a bag catalog. Uh, our drinkware, as you see here, we have eco-friendly items, which leads our bamboo is really where, where it leads. We have some RPET items available as well. That's in the eco-friendly catalog. All these are downloadable on our website uh, through Zoom catalog. And, of course, <clears throat> we'll be remiss to say quarterly specials. There's Q1 specials. Sorry, following along here. Uh, the one thing about Q1, think about our specials is we have quarterly specials, we have category specials all in the same place. So what you'll find is in the quarterly specials, we've got drinkware, healthcare, we've got wellness items, household items, we've got writing instruments, office. So in here, we've and some bags on sale. We've got like six to seven categories six to seven items in each category plus uh so the quarterly special you're getting about 40 to 50 pieces on sale across the board and then additionally there we will have 
uh, about five more additional products in that mini catalog area on the website that you can download if you want just drinkware. So there'll be uh, drinkware on sale for uh, monthly specials. So those you can download. We have probably 80 different products across all of our categories on sale at all times. You just have to look for them. Not to fear if you don't want to go through that process. If you just stumble upon an item uh, on the, the Adams page on the website, if it's on sale, you'll be told there's well, so you're not going to miss it. But if you want to do some marketing on your own, you want to do some on your own website or just personally with someone, uh, you say, I want to offer a, a special to a client. We can do virtuals for, for you, put them all on one page. Uh, we're not doing the custom mini catalogs this year. We can put them on one page for you through uh, Story Plus, Storyboard Plus on the HPG website, and uh, you would know what items you're on sale and give them a little special. Tell you what goes on with the special. So when you see it on sale, I want you to know that on sale means it is second column quantity, and then price is going to be 3% of EQP. So you don't have to do any figuring. What is this? Is this too high, too low? Everything is very stable for you. So uh, look for that. Uh, the Corby special should be out about uh, two weeks before, a week and a half before the, the start of the quarter. So uh, you can do some planning ahead. Don't forget also there we have category cards. So you see education, insurance, nonprofit organizations. And so these are vertical markets that obviously you sell into. So we take logos that we see that we know we're going into education, going into insurance, going into legal, things like that. And we just kind of mark them. Just give us some uh, some 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 data to, to show you that on the back of the education card is the best selling items that people in the education, companies in the education market are purchasing. These are available. We haven't been a lot of the shows we attend, but they are available uh, on our website and also through our sample department. They're called uh, category cards. Also, this is kind of a cool thing. So with, when we talk about eco-friendly, I do want to show you this is just a magnet clip. It has a bamboo trim here. So what we're trying to do with the bamboo is, uh, we all know cutting boards, charcuterie boards. We have bamboo trim, tumblers, uh, pens. So we're trying to use a bamboo as an accent piece as well. So it gives you that eco-friendly uh, eco buyer. It's very tough. And people have different definitions of what's eco-friendly. Uh, so this kind of gives you a little... Just something else to work with. Just another product to sell. Um, have some bamboo on there. It's, you know, bamboo is very plentiful and is a uh, is uh, uh, across probably twenty five to thirty items we have available in bamboo, and also part of our gift box program. So, uh, oh, faithful. Talking about two old faithfuls. We're at a trade show. Your clients are going to be doing trade shows. We want trade show giveaways. I'm telling you, the 3500 the bandage dispenser, this is like 98 cent sale, 89 cent sale. I'm telling you, it's funny today, a, a booth full of people here at HPG, and someone actually needed a band aid. Boom, we actually have it. I mean, we manufacture these, so there is no inventory issues. As I like to say, if you're in a meeting with me, I say it 10 times every meeting infinite inventory. That's what made in the USA needs, infinite inventory. If you want 5,000 of these by the end of next week, you don't have to call. You just place your order, five-day standard production. We have the two words, Evans Anywhere. That Put that in your ship uh, to your ship via sale and your PO. We will ship anything in the line, UPS three-day air at ground rates. Evans Anywhere. So that gives you a little ace in the hole if you – Need to shave a couple of days going from the uh, West Coast to the East Coast. Uh, but the, the 3,500 bands is dispenser. Great item. Of course, the pizza cutter. For those of you that know or don't know, National Pizza Day is uh, February 14th. Can't forget that. Valentine's Day, National Pizza Day. So right now, uh, I know we can't do rushes on uh, pizza cutter because uh, they are it's, – it's pizza cutter selling season, if you will. So uh, don't look outside at the snow. It's uh, pizza cutting selling season. That's what you want to tell people. So we manufacture these totally infinite inventory, five-day production. We can do full color printing as well. So and we also offer standard, I mean, a stainless steel blade option as well for you. So 
give me some questions so I have something to do for the next few minutes. People could stare at me. Uh, what else do I have to talk about? I think I showed you guys everything. The journal. This is a suede journal. Okay, so this is our 1417. Journals are a big thing in the office category, big product. So this is a suede. So it has the band here, right? The closure. Very high-end uh, journal. So we will be using four safe paper that uh, is rolling into the line. It will be stamped in the back. I think it's FSC, I think is what it's called. So that... This journal, this and this comes in a very like two shades of brown, which give it a really rich look. So if you want a very upscale journal, like but you don't want a leather, this is a suede material. So the blue and the black, but this comes in a dark and a light brown. That's a very um, been a very popular item here the first couple hours of the show. So this one here, I just um, I just saw it in Orlando, but it sells for uh, five fifty. So this is see here. And really that high-end paper, ruled, that light brown, four safe certified paper we're putting into the line. That would be across the line as we're, we're mixing that in for 2024. And I brought the blue in here for you. So the 1417, great item. We'll tell you, I wish I could turn the camera around because the traffic is very good here. Lots and lots of people, which is what you're going to see. That's good for the industry. You guys, I tell you, we've been, I was in Orlando a couple of weeks ago and been home last week in the office, and just a lot of, uh, I call it chatter, is going on out there. So a lot of you guys are busy. Um, and we are, I tell you, here at HPG, we've got everything you could possibly need, except apparel, but everything you could possibly need. So tools is new for Evans. Really made the USA infinite inventory. That is what you want to uh, to think because I know you go to all you work you work very hard to get an order, and then it's just to be told that that is not available. It's coming later. Uh, is really uh, you got to start all over. So uh, with Evans, it's just peace of mind, good quality core products that uh, you can really just set and forget it. Just these totes, you can go to market and just sell them every day in quantities. And uh, hey, Don, you're, you're back. Yeah, I went through everything. I was running around the booth looking at all the clothes. Did you? I went what do you through think everything. Let's see if there, we have some any questions. questions in here for you. Yeah, yeah. I should have um, told my family I was here so they could send some questions. <laughs> Man. Uh, your your mom says, Don, you should have worn a different shirt. <laughs> I know. I mean, guys, that's that's not my color. Yeah. Yeah. Don's mom. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't see any big questions in here. I think people are appreciative of what Evans does, made the yeah. USA products and all that. So Listen, I said knows. it to them. Infinite inventory, that's the biggest headache distributors get right yeah, yeah, yeah. you work so hard you get the order we got it bam and that's that really across hpg the the, the inventory level i mentioned how our largest uh new product uh push this year yeah, yeah. across all the lines really i mean right. you want to sell it you sold it you want to deliver it that's what you know i'll do a very good job of and that. we can deliver right don uh you and i will never Just have to you. deliver me and you deliver we yeah. drive our truck with with all these amazing yes, yes. tumblers. So send all yeah. the uh, stainless steel orders to Nick and HPG. It's called Nick Rush at HPGbrands.com. And I'll get that out for you. Yeah. Don't, like email that. That. don't email that. Let's email. try it. Let's try it once. We should try it once. Well, thanks, Don. Yeah, um, guys. I don't see any other questions in here. Um, Don's going to pack up. Next up here in about 10 minutes or so, we're going to have what's new at Beacon. Beacon has some cool stuff, too. So we're moving right along. Thanks, everybody, for joining this awesome live stream from HPG Brands. And, uh, We'll be back with more soon. See you soon.
All right, everybody, we're popping back in live. Hi. Sharon's here. It's a busy day. It's Sharon Schiffel-Huber. Hang on, Sharon. I got to give you a mic. Oh, you got to mic me This up. is a busy day. Look, Sharon's one of the most popular people at all of HPG, as you know. So let me do this, Sharon. Okay, mic me up. Sharon's been in meetings all day. She's going to show us today, or right now, a few more Beacon products. We saw her earlier, but she's got a little bit more in-depth detail about it. In-depth detail. And here's what I'm going to do, everybody. By the way, we're live. This is live. So if you're on our live stream, please go in the chat and ask questions uh, for Sharon, for us. I'll monitor it. I'm going to go Good. away so, so the lovely Sharon can talk. I am going to. I you, will miss you, though. I miss you Come too. back soon. Um, All right? Okay. Now get off the stage. All right. No, I'm just Fair kidding. No. All right. So what we're going to talk about today is, you know, sustain oh, <laughs> sustainability. You know, we have in HPG so many items that are sustainable. Great thing about Beacon is we have a lot of totes. So you see, this is our most popular tote. This is like the Lululemon bag. Now you see this little tag. It says, I used to be plastic, but now I'm fantastic. So we've got like six totes. This size, we have the trade show one, but you know what? We also have a string bag. So, so many different types, and they all have that adorable little tag. So, think about that. Think about your totes, or maybe rethink about your totes. Now, this one here, you've seen plenty of cargo carriers. I know. This one has the strap, or you have the side handles, but guess what? This used to be plastic, but now it's fantastic. So, this is also made out of RPET. So, those are kind of our totes, and don't forget, I don't have one up here. We also have leather goods. So don't forget about our Canyon leather duffels. Awesome. Okay, I got off track there for a minute. So now we go to the kitchen. Now Beacon is known for kitchen tools, table covers, name badges. Some of our newest, latest and greatest kitchen items is this great trivet. So this is ceramic, so it has a nice weight to it. We put that cork on the back, but see this? This is your entire imprint area. So you could do a step and repeat. If I wanted, I could put Nick's face on this. I wouldn't want to do that, but I could. So we're going to have some stock backgrounds, but maybe you want to put a map or maybe your customer loves plaid or polka dots. We can do anything on there. And it's all included in that price. It's a full color, under $13, awesome, awesome piece. Also for the kitchen, I'm going into my bag. Also for the kitchen, we have some brand new stainless steel tongs. Okay, so these are heat resistant because it's silicone, but you can see, I don't know if you could see, this is a laser etch, it's gonna show as gold, but these are a great piece, a great addition to any kitchen, but also if, you know, maybe you wanna use them outdoors because you can use them for barbecuing. So those are our tongs, and you see this, that locks it, and you can also hang some, hang it from someplace in the kitchen. The next up, uh, I didn't have enough coffee today, as you can tell, but this is our coffee scoop and our clip. So this is also stainless. So you have stainless. We love stainless here at Pekin. So you get a nice laser etched in purple. But what's nice about these laser etched, as I told you, is they show is gold. So that's another new product for the kitchen. Now, what else do I have in here? Well, this isn't a kitchen item. It's kind of sort of a kitchen item. We have a ton of coasters at Beacon. We have car coasters, we have ceramic coasters, slate, acacia wood, we have glass, any kind of coaster you can think of. Now we have a vinyl or a record coaster. That's right, the center here is where your logo goes and you see it has a hole right in the middle, just like a regular vinyl would be. So if you're having maybe a retro event, or maybe you have a theme and you want it to be the Rocky Horror Show, Picture Show. Whatever it may be, you can put it on this great record, poster, great piece. All right, I said tools, remember? I don't know if you remember. Nick, Somebody am I almost tools? done? Tools? Oh, I, oh no. No, no, not you, not you. Now, if I would have said that to him, I would have gotten in trouble. So, lights and tools, flashlights. Now, somewhere on my desk, oh, here it is. How do you make a flashlight eco-friendly? Well, we like the flashlight to be durable, so you want them out of metal. To make them eco-friendly and sustainable, make them rechargeable. So we have an entire line 
called Renew. And basically, you can recharge them over and over again, never have to buy batteries again. And this one is called, this, I call this like a MacGyver item because it has a bottle opener, a carabiner. It's laser etched. It also has a hook for hanging and a metal back. And let me tell you, this is bright. Be prepared. See how nice and bright that is? And it's rechargeable. So these are COB lights. So remember, anytime you see a flashlight with yellow, you know they're COB, which means chips on board. So you get more light, use less battery, and these are all rechargeable. The other Renew piece is called, it's a retro lantern, vintage lantern. So again, at Beacon, we have about four or five different lanterns. Uh, everything from a $6 lantern up to something like this, this is gonna be in the $16 range. But you can see it's nice and bright. Your imprint area is right there and you can lower it and higher it. But again, it's rechargeable because it's what? The Renew line, you're absolutely right. Okay, so last but certainly not least is, oops, our Brightworks. A lot of tools, you know, use multi-tools, but this one, now I hope I don't drop it. Oh, that's my big fear. So nice and compact. There are 30 tools in here, but what we did at Beacon is we added a light. So maybe you have this on your workbench and you need that extra light. So let me get it, the light out first. See what happens? The light comes up. So your imprint is still on top of the light. You turn this on and, oops. It's my nails guys, I'm sorry. See how bright, now there's three settings. High and then you get like a glow. This is what I look better in, in this light and then um, a little bit lighter. And then I'm gonna try to show you what the tools look like. I don't know if you could see this, but it's very compact, great. Every tool, everything from uh, Allen wrenches to screwdrivers, there's about 10 different bits. You have additional pieces here. You even have a box cutter all in this handy dandy piece. So that comes in here. This is the bright works. So keep that in mind. Um, something else I want to remind you of is don't forget Beacon does name badges. We didn't put any new name badges out. And I know name badges can be, oh, people can't stand doing name badges, but Beacon makes it easy. So remember we have plastic, minimum of 10 pieces. We've got metal, we can do custom uh, sizes. So think of Beacon for name badges. And last but not least is table covers. Don't have naked tables. This is the perfect time of year to go back to your customers once they start doing all trade shows like we're doing here and make sure they have a table cover. Because a lot of times they come back from a show, they forgot to take the table cover or they packed it, now it's all wrinkled. Maybe the logo changed or maybe they stained it. So keep that in mind. We have six foot, we have four foot, six foot. I'm six eight foot, foot five. Three, oh. I could put a table cover on you. Um, three sided, four sided, flat fitted, convertible, whatever you need. Um, that's all I have. Well, is that okay? Is, I think that's okay. Listen, um, you gave me these earlier. I did. And I did. I'm hungry for a snack. Okay. Earlier, if you guys were live with us earlier, we did a whole booth walkthrough. It was fun. We were in the sugar spot section with Sharon. He always has to have candy because he gets hangry when he doesn't get it. Like, he's not fed every hour. <laughs> you know what kind those are? Yeah. Tell you. Oh, you can't. Uh, these, uh, oh, these are lips. They these, come in four different colors. You guys might have seen the uh, sugar peanut had like a viral candy thing. These are the sour pucker up lips that were very, very, very popular, very famous. We'll talk about these in the sugar shop. All right, yeah, time. we'll be back. All right, I'm going to go. Is that we'll okay? Be, that's okay, Sharon. You can do whatever you want. We'll be, okay. right, we'll be right back, everybody. With um, We'll be right back. We'll be right back. Bye. Yeah. I won't be back. <laughs> He'll be back. All right. Uh
tell us when we're actually live. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Or, or I'll just start talking. Hey, everybody, we're back live yet again. That's why we're live all day, right, Kate? Always live, always on. I don't even know how you're keeping your energy at this level. Because this is awesome. I'm going to like pull <laughs> into fun. one of the rooms and just have a nap afterwards. Uh, so. Well, I'll do that later. But yeah. right now we're in the midst of this amazing <laughs> trade show. Um, and now it's time for What's New at Debco, starring Kate Plummer. Kate Plummer. <laughs> so for those that don't know me, yeah. I am the new director of sales for Debco and Beacon. So I am Canadian. I've been in the industry for ages. I like to say legally 16 years and then illegally 30 because child labor is okay when it's your kids. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so that's just so that's all right. the parents know out there. Uh, but this is great. So Debco. If you're not familiar with Debco, we're based in Toronto. We have the widest range of drinkware, everything else. So yeah. you want drinkware, you want totes, you want journals. I'm going to stop you really oh, quick because yeah? I neglected to say earlier, Kate's going to show you a bunch of Debco stuff. Please, if you have any questions, get in the chat. I'm going to help Kate answer those questions. Um, and I'm yeah. here for moral support and, and to be Vanna White and the whole thing. So we'll show you. Beautiful, them the beautiful. So ask questions of Kate, of me, of life. We can answer life questions okay. too. Yeah, I'm here for you. So we're going to start with the biggest one here in that I'm going to keep pulling out. So this is our rugged tote. It's from oh. our Glacier Peak line. So we are, a lot of our products are retail inspired. So our drinkware, you're looking for Yeti, Stanley, et cetera, go, go to Demco. We've got them. So this is the first one. Ooh. This one's cool. Again, drinkware, drinkware is really interesting because drinkware is like a fashion accessory for people right mm. now. It's kind of why Stanley has gone well so far. Like this? It's just like that. Just Vogue. Just like, like show it off. Like You've this. got it. You've got it. So. <laughs> so this is our one. Comfort carrying handle. Men's down. Do full color imprint on it. Super cool. This one I kind of love because coffee. Are you a coffee tea drinker? Oh, yeah. Are you a water drinker? Yeah, oh, yeah. Every day? I'm one of those water drinkers. Oh, my God. Me too. <laughs> it's great. So coffee the spout for that but then you're just like i need something else it turns into let's show everybody at home what you just did here we have a little side camera okay Kendra, sorry no go for it I then away. cool so yeah um as kate said you open kind of the lid for the the deep pour uh the deep gulp coffee or water yeah and then what was this part the little sippy little straw yeah spout you've got that um well i don't want to get you off track but what <laughs> tell me about this really interesting curved handle this is, this is really cool. So it's one of those, like, we really kind of aim to be, we take what's really nice and then we up it a little bit more. Okay. So great feature, love it. And you know, you're kind of like, oh, everyone has their favorite water bottle. Everyone has their favorite thing. But if it's always like, like you, you've talked to people, you have a favorite water bottle. I do. And it's a Depco one. It is an HPG water okay, bottle. Solid, solid. As long as it's HPG. I'll, switch, I'll, I'll make sure I have a Depco in the line. <laughs> I'll get you a Depco one. Um, so it is one of those things is like everyone has that feature that they absolutely love. So we took a look at what's out in the market there and we went, what would make this even better? I mean, right there, they've done the market research. They've done it. But we know our market yeah. and we know, you know, sort of like what will be the brand and the design feature that keeps you going. That you're like, yeah, this is the one. In your cupboard of all the drinkware, because I mean, especially promo people have that drinkware of everything. Yeah. How do we make this better? So curved handle, designed for grip. Ah, you have it, but at the same time, when it bends down, you see? I see. It lines up, so it's oh, there. Let me show it's a little smooth. closer it's up look. It's to the bottom. It's ergonomic, and, and it doesn't always stay, right? Like, I like the word ergonomic, I'm going to say. It's a good one. But as you it's fold it down, speed. it lays flat. That's yeah. right. Streamlined yeah. for easier access. Yes, exactly. Oh, that's so cool. That's really unique. I haven't seen yeah. that in the industry. It's kind of like, the, and again, it's we took something that was really good that sells, but our price point is better. Our price point is there, and it's one of those, you want something where people can just kind of keep using, yeah. and then this is the reliable one. Ooh, love so, it, yeah. love it, love it. That's our drinkware item. Yeah. Okay, in the rugged tote, you okay. see... You're gonna be amazed at all the stuff I'm pulling out here. I, I just won't. pillaged this is our like entire Mary Poppins, view. Like, purse, I know. Right? I know. Just... Don't jump ahead. Whoa, Don't jump like ahead. Pop. Okay. I know, but it is. It's a lot here. Okay. Mugs. Mugs. People know mugs. People you know have mugs. your favorite coffee mug, right? I do, and it's a Debco mug. Yes. Okay. Even better. This is everyone's favorite coffee mug from Debco. This is our number one seller. 
cork bottom. So you're doing like, oh yeah, I know, tiny it's audio like thing. On the it's a sensory experience. You wake up, you get your coffee. You have this beautiful matte finish to it, and no loud clunks. Because like if the, your coffee hasn't kicked in in the morning, you definitely want, you know, you don't want it to make a loud sound. No, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> but it, again, the other thing is, we're, you know, HPG is focusing on sustainable materials. Oh yeah. And that is our focus for everything. And it's something when we're designing products, we're going like, okay, what can we bring in? Okay. That makes us more sustainable. What can we bring in that makes us more sustainable? Cork bottom. Right? Cork. Oh, uh, <laughs> for renewable resource, Kate. Exactly. I love it. So yeah, so we have this. I'm gonna keep this one. This is mine now. <laughs> That's your new mug. Fine. So it is. Devco has a huge range of mugs. Really cool things. We can do beautiful decoration on it. We can like full color print. It kind of keeps it going. Okay. So okay. everyone has a favorite mug, and I can tell you right now, the one you just tried to steal. Tried? I kind of did. I kind of stole end. it. I'm coming back for it. Okay, we're gonna go along this trend of sustainability here. On. You're on our journey. I'm on. I feel. I on feel I'm ready. How much recycled stainless steel material do you think is in this product? People don't make drinkware with recycled stainless steel. Kate. You were wrong, Nicholas. It's gotta be you like are so zero. Wrong. I'm wrong. You're wrong. This is 80% recycled stainless steel. Wow. I know, right? That's actually shocking. Like, that's uh, <laughs> it's impressive. I, I right? thought it'd be like 30, 40, 50. It's 80 percent recycled stainless steel. 80 percent. And it's beautiful. Which it feels great. nice too. I know. Like, this, this journey also... is taking you to places I never knew it would. I know. You thought you'd just get Debco products. This has been <laughs> no, way so more. Much more. Okay. Standard. This is a classic. It's a classic for the reason for a reason. Yeah. Everyone has one of these. Except you know this looks like a premium model and you know it's made from 80 percent recycled stainless steel yeah how it's better and better you know how you feel thing you know how we we're in this a trade show hall with thousands tens of hundreds yeah. of thousands of products really yeah. and sometimes you could pick up something that looks nice when it feels this yeah. feels like a substantial really well built yeah. product with 80 percent stainless steel it's unreal i know this and again it's going towards that sustainability feature so you have someone a lot of times stainless like recycled products yeah. especially drinkware we're looking at glass, we're looking at ceramic, things like recycled material. We have gone after stainless steel and, we, and it's insulated. This isn't a single wall thing. You're putting your coffee in there. Later in the day when you realize, oh my God, why is my head pounding? Your coffee's still hot in there. Okay, it's I'll remember thing. that. Yeah. Okay, this is a little bit of a detour. We're moving a little away from our drinkware. Okay, but we're on a journey we're still. We're still on a journey. I'll, I'll put this over here okay, so that perfect. the uh, journey can continue. Yeah. Have you, are you a golfer? I like to play golf. Okay, I, I am That's not. what I say, I like to play golf. <laughs> yes. Am I good? Don't ask no. me that. Okay, no follow-up questions no on follow that No follow-up, please. Okay, I, I'm this a is golfer. our, <laughs> I too, as long as it's mini putt, and the balls are like bright neon colors. Yeah. I'm like really good at golf when it's when it's mini putt. I believe you. Um, if it's harder, I am not good at golf, but I'm really good at happy hour for golf. Happy hour golf? Yeah, it's the part after golf, where I'm oh, happy see. that I'm not golfing. I think they call it the 19th hole. Yeah, I'm really good at that one. Okay, yeah, That's yeah. the one I do. That's right, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I do that. But well, I'm not, I'm not a, a golfer. golfer. I'm going to uh, tell you right a, now. You're going to have to sell this need. product here. Oh, well, well, this is a golf club brush. So yes. uh, as, as someone who plays golf really terribly, my club goes into the ground and gets gunk and stuff in it. And, and I don't it's need to tell good. anyone watching about golf, but your clubs get dirty. You need to clean them. And uh, and everyone has every golfer has a brush because you're, you gotta got to scrape the clothes clean, right? But how many times have you, are you digging for that golf brush somewhere? Um, not if it has a retractable lanyard on it, a little exactly. carabiner clip. Again, yeah. Debco's taken a product and thought, how can we make it better for you? That's right, That's little it. dome decal print on the retractable lanyard. This is a great golf uh, tournament giveaway too, right? Like, right. Uh, and right now, our show special is for self promo, thirty percent off. All of our golf items. Ooh, thirty percent off all golf. I'm sorry, you mean talking? No, go ahead, go. Thirty percent off of all golf items on a self promo from Debco. That's pretty good. I know. That's so, uh, it's now the time to that. do it because golf season's coming. Start in, planning uh, ahead. You want? Yes, yes, yes. It's kind of that idea is like you don't give a Christmas turkey at Christmas. You give it in Thanksgiving, so people know to give a Thanksgiving turkey. So you're not going to give that exactly at golf season. Yes. Okay, stay yeah. with me here. Okay. Now. Okay. You're going to give that now. So when they're thinking, what right. golf items do I need? Boom. That's done. right. Um, Look, but, they have that sitting 
For on the record, yes. anyone can give me a Christmas turkey any time of year. I will gladly accept turkey it. I love all turkey. Year round. Yeah. It doesn't have to be Christmas turkey. It could be like an Easter turkey or. It could be like a happy June uh, turkey. It could be, right. Yeah. Fourth you know, of July turkey. Valentine's Day Boxing turkey. Boxing Day turkey. It'd be amazing. Yeah. Yeah. You got it all. Okay. Yeah. So there, protective cover to you. All set. Love it. Love it. Okay. We're back on our. Oh. Okay. I missed the point. So we're going to circle back to drinkware on okay. this journey. Understood. Sustainable feature. Do you know about our ugly, beautiful box? I know that it's ugly, and I know that it's beautiful at the same time. It's both. It and, is. And I think it's also recyclable. It is. Okay. It's made with 90% recycled. Oh, no, sorry. It's 100% recycled craft paper. Yes, yes. So this and all of our drinkware comes in this box. This is the so standard right packaging here. for all drinkware. Yeah. This way, in any other boxes that you might get with products, might not be recyclable. They end up in the trash anyway. This is actually a yeah. lot more sustainable packaging. It is. So, and it's just a lot. Like, you know, you're getting something and it's coming in the plastic bag. It's not exciting. Yeah. All of our drinkware comes in Debco's ugly, beautiful box. Kate, the way people receive things is sometimes more important than what they're receiving, right? Exactly. If they get it in the a nice thing? box, they're going to feel much happier. It comes about. safe and sound. Yeah. I know, right? It's, it's also gone on a journey to you. It's safe. I love this journey. It's a, it's a great journey metaphor to pull through this entire thing. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Our hair. Lots of hair. Okay. What else do you think is in this giant tote? There could be like an elephant in here. There could be, I don't know. I'm, I'm it's so not chilly an elephant. In here. You're, you're so wrong. I feel like, oh, okay. So we are going to pull out Ooh. the sweater weather. weather. Sweater weather. Sweater weather. Sweater weather. Yeah. This is the sweater weather. <laughs> Blanket. Yes. <laughs> Sweater Thank weather. You. Thank you for your help here. Can it's you tell? It's day one. It's day one of Expo. Yes. I'm doing so well right now. Tell me about Sweater Weather. This was one of our top selling products last year. Okay. It's cozy, super oh, yeah. cozy. It you feels have, like literally like a really nice sweater. Right? This is the one in this weather. You know, if you didn't get here because your plane got delayed, you're sitting in a blizzard. This is really what you want to wrap yourself in while you're like crying tears and like watching this live stream. Crying tears. Because you couldn't be here, so we're working to bring you here. Yeah. But you should have this blanket right now. Yes. So, oh man. I I'm gonna add this to my collection of things I'm taking home. Okay, but wait. Oh. But there's wait, there's more? more. Oh no. What would make this better? I don't know, maybe a, a cup of coffee. No, oh. but yes. Okay. What else? Ooh. All of this goes into this pillowcase. Oh, this is the case that the, the sweater weather yeah. so blanket goes in. So it's not a in. loose blanket. We're not like putting it in this like storage unit that doesn't hold it. Yeah. So sometimes it's hot and you don't need a blanket. Oh, I see. So it's almost like a pillow it. now. So once you put the sweater weather blanket inside of here, you've yep. got a cozy, nice, soft pillow as well. Exactly. So wow. think in terms of gifting, we're talking about high-end clients, you know, kind of like what would make someone really happy and what's a product that's going to it's not a it's not a giveaway where you're like, oh that's great, that's cool. Toss it on the pile. Yeah. This is gonna be this is someone's home. This is like it's going on their couch. They're pulling it out for guests, but yes. then like pulling out their other one for the guest, and then they actually keep they this, one. this one. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. a good one. You wanna keep that. Hey Kate. So yeah. We have a question actually. Oh yeah. I'm gonna check this. This is from uh, Bonnie okay. Nichols. She said, What is the bottle number with the handle, the item number for this bottle? This one. Okay. Do we have the item number handy? Um I will get that for you. Apollo. That's a good question. I'm blanking on it too. I know. You can find I'm all of these items it. at hbgbrands.com. Um, yes. It is and, part of our I'm glacier. Sorry. It's, oh, it's called Everglades. So you can look for the Everglades bottle. If you go to hbgbrands.com and type Everglades in the search bar, this bottle will pop yeah. up. Yes. Apologies. Yeah. There's a lot of skews I'm learning here. Well, you're learning, but also like yeah. we're in a live environment and there are thousands and millions of products. So. I know. But wouldn't it be really cool if I knew? It would be cool. Yeah. Okay. But, I'll work on that. But so. she said it earlier. Yeah. Kate is the literally the newest member of our team here, and mm -hmm. we're so happy to have Kate on board to I'm handle all the things you're handling. I'm I've always admired it. you, so I'm so happy I get to work with Thank you, you. too. Uh, so that's fine. Little I, a little love. That's a, while, uh, that's a love journey. <laughs> I don't, that's not the right. That's not the right terminology. Uh, HR. Uh, for the record, Kate and I are not on a love journey. No. We are, we're on a, a very good friendship <laughs> journey. Oh God, I'm digging a hole. Ah, quick. Wait, how do you pivot? Oh, is the audio going like it? Okay. <laughs> Thank God. Okay, let's Day go one. back to our presentation to the journey of the tote bag. Okay, tote bag, rugged tote. Nicholas, how yes. much have we pulled 
from this tote bag. So much stuff. And yeah, can you pull out the yeah, stuff you stole all in All the there? stuff Thank was you. in this enormous uh, and very nice looking tote yeah. bag. Tell me Tarp about lid it. material. Tarp Again, lid? we've kind of gone for the retail inspired. Okay. You see the Yeti ones, they sell for hundreds of dollars. That is not this case. So okay. you're about 75 on a C. Okay. Reliable. You have all these like the Little hooks. loopy hookies. Oddly enough, this is a favorite feature of people. Look what? how big the zipper. Yeah, oh, the zipper tag it looks like an anchor, like You're a double kinda, finger like, kind of. That's heavy duty. That's nice. Right? It's durable, yeah. especially like think about like where would you use this tote bag? Oh, anywhere the beach. I would take it on beach? golf trips. I would it take with it. sand. It's not a problem. You just tip <laughs> it out. It <laughs> it's waterproof, right? So you you could yeah. put ice in. Yeah. It'd be good. Fill it. Ice there. You insulated. throw all your beer for the beach in there. You take it with golf. You put your golf tools in there. Yeah. There's pockets inside. Yeah. Oh, this like is extremely this utilitarian and rugged. So yeah, it's material. Like rip. Yeah. This is the one. It holds over 50 pounds of stuff. Whoa. So, so these handles are yeah. ready to, to carry. They're going. Wow. And don't think of it just so like, oh, it's like a boat bag. It's meant for the beach. I'm doing this. You got tools, you go into a site, you want to throw everything in there and you want to have it easily accessible. Mm. This is the bag you use. Well, okay. So what you're saying to me is this, this yeah. these new products from Depco will all go back in this bag and I will take them home with me to use. Yes. Every, yeah. Is that this what is I'm perfect getting? for when you're just kind of going shopping throughout the booth and you're just like grabbing being like, I'd love that. Yeah, I'd yeah. love this. Yeah. It's going to hold it all for you. So. I love it. I love yeah. it. Kate, is there anything yes. else you want to tell our fine folks? I'm going to look to see. Um, oh, someone answered it. It's WB9724. Thank Amazing. you for the help. Thank and you. Thank you. Any Again, other questions, I'll learn please, for next time. time so. uh, no, it's, listen, it's okay. Yeah. Being, a, being a new person <laughs> uh, to our company, there's no, she's already okay. beyond the expectations we would ever have. I'm working this on it. So amazing. I would think of it a lot of times like we're HPG North. We're your Canadian outfitters, but we also have the FOB point in New York. So it is anything that you see. Don't think of us just as Canada. We can do the whole U.S. We got touchscreen gloves, which I don't know. You're from Texas, so yeah. your experience with touchscreen gloves is going to be a little bit different. It's limited. Yeah, but when you're really cold, you don't want to have to take your gloves off to use your phone. You have the sensor on there where you can use it. That's fantastic. Know, you might not be, you don't need it, unless you get those like rare snowstorms for it. So. Yeah, yeah, but even then, we just stay inside and cry. Um, I have a last question for yeah. you, Kate. So you're, oh, we've established Kate's one of the newest members of our team. Mm -hmm. We're in this enormous trade show, but there's a lot going yeah. on, especially at Depco and, and Beacon, of course. But what's your initial takeaways from this whole event and this whole show? Like, what what are you surprised at or what, what are you excited about? Oh, my God. I'm excited. I feel like people, I think 2023 was really rough for a lot of people. But that's not the energy you're feeling here at all. Everyone's really excited. I also love seeing everything like HPG as a whole family has like it's kind of one of those like we want to be your number one source for everything and I think we I think we are like between our pens our like our lip balms our speakers everything yeah. else you come to us for it and we've got that so I like being and then everyone works so well together HPG people are just really nice people so yeah. the welcome has been really good yeah. so yeah. yeah and one last thing I want to leave everyone on is Debco specifically is what we call Debco internally HPG North. And, and because Debco will carry products from all of our companies, Handstands, Orgadio, Best, Beacon. So if you have an FOB in Canada, yeah. you can get it all specifically from Debco. Exactly. Uh, we take we have the best sellers, so you don't have to worry about cross cross border shopping there. Yeah. Although we all do love cross border shopping. All the Canadians there. Um, but it is we want, we're your source for it. And if you're not seeing it on the site and you're just like, help us out, we're also your source for it. So you're the best, Kate. Palmer. <laughs> thank you, Nick. All right. All right, everybody. Thank you so much. Thanks to Kate. Um, no more questions right now. If you do, please put them in the chat. We're going to answer them all day. We're going to be live all day. Um, my God. Coming up Keep next. Watching. That's right. Keep Fabulous. watching. We've we got another, plans, we've got so. another what's new segment yeah. here in 10 minutes. So you'll get some coffee or Send some POs to HPG probably is a better and idea. Follow up on what was the code number for that one again? Uh, this one is the Everglades uh, WB9724. Okay, that's the one you want. Send sample requests. Get yourself a sweater, weather blanket, especially if you're sweater at home weather. and you haven't come in. And then the rugged tote. Think of the uses. Think of everything you're going to put in this rugged tote, and we're good. Oh, yeah.
Thank you, Kate. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks, everyone. We'll be right back.
right, welcome back, everybody. I know the next segment says Sharon Schiffelhuber for Sugar Spot, but you're stuck with me. Apologies. Um, but it's kind of a good thing because I love candy more than anything. Uh, the bad news for the people here is I'm going to start eating this candy, so the samples won't be good to look at. Uh, the good news for you guys is uh, uh, I have a lot of passion surrounding sugar. Um, not a good idea for long-term health, but <laughs> for, <laughs> for immediate impact and for great branding presence, there's nothing better than these colors and the candy. If you don't know, Sugar Spot is our candy line. If you ever heard of a company called Sugar Fina, uh, there's a, they, they have the little cubes that you'll find in um, Nordstrom, Nordstrom Rack of those really cool, really nice, high-end, beautiful, tasty candies. Uh, we can be called the Sugar Fina for the promotional products industry because we have full custom jars, full custom packaging packets, uh, pack, uh, excuse me, kits and sets with it as well. Uh, so, but it's on a C, if that makes sense. So um, we've got your needs. Um, the new new launch this season for Sugar Spot has been a whole variety of beautiful, colorful candies. Uh, 28, I believe, to be exact. And I'm not going to go through all of them, but we have things like, you know, we have things from like the Swedish fish that, you're rec that you will recognize all the way up to these really fun, colorful watermelon bears. And they're this kind of like turquoise color. Uh, what we like to encourage people to do with or sugar spot candy is maybe to match logo colors or brand guideline colors with candy because we have essentially all of the options from like a bright apple green to reds, peaches, the, the Pantone color of the year. Uh, we have some some colors that might match that a little bit. Um, so these are great for giveaways events when, when you give out the jars of candy, of course, for sort of one off to like elevate your event. Uh, one really popular set we do is in this little jute bag, we'll put two or three jars of candy inside so it's a nice little satchel that people will have at the uh i don't know at the trade show meeting spot where they're all set out for people uh networking events things like that really great presentation for this um we also have a little bit of a streamlined sort of gift packaging this box which will fit up to three small jars uh of our sugar spot candy so that's more of like a sort of holiday gift or corporate gift angle can you ship to canada can I ship to Canada is a question on here? Right now, no. Um, this is all USA stuff, and, and we're not shipping the food over the border to Canada right now. Um, we're working on maybe some things in the future to, to make that happen. Right now, though, if you place an order today, it wouldn't be able to happen. Apologies for that. Thank you, Jeff, for letting me know the question. Fun stuff, though. Um, and then this is one of our newest features. This is the Oh So Sweet kit. And this is the actual box it comes in. This is a really, it's like an iridescent, flashy, shiny box. Comes with a little gift note on the inside. And this box fits nine of our large jars of candy. And if I just said nine jars of candy, you might be like, eh, this is, this is a heavy duty, uh, this is basically a half pound of candy in these large jars. So you're getting a, a big bang for your buck here. This is for like a, a team building gift or something you want to send to someone to really show some impact. This is called the Oh So Sweet box. I'm doing this in case the camera can pick up the shiny iridescence of this box. It's almost mesmerizing, folks. Um, that's kind of all I have on the Sugar Spot world right now. What I'll tell you is that we run really great self-promo deals on Sugar Spot, 20% off of EQP for you guys. So if you want to do a Sugar Spot self-promo, maybe put a couple of our taster packets I think I ate all the taster packets, uh, put the taster packets in, in, in a jute bag like this, and the recipient's going to love it. They're going to they're gonna think they got a really special, nice gift. Uh, uh, check out hpgbrands.com slash sugar spot, and you'll go directly to all of those candies. Or you can go to our website and type in candy, and everything will populate there. Then you can filter and sort out by color, by flavor, all that stuff. So um, We're getting sweet. I hope we don't get salty today. Uh, that would be bad for you guys, uh, but we're, we're keeping it sweet. Thanks again. Let me see if there are any other questions. Um, thanks, Karen. Again, we, we're not able to, to uh, ship to Canada. Apologies there. Um, but uh, we're going to move on today to the next segment. We're, we might go live cam here in a second, walk around the booth a little bit. Just it, They'll be muted. There'll be no, no audio, but you can see kind of what's happening around the booth. And that might be fun just to kind of get a recap. And then we're going to come back. And uh, in about 20 minutes with, ooh, what's new at BCG Creations? That's uh, Zach. He's going to talk about BCG, which is a Canadian company, Kelly and Karen. So we have FOBs in Canada and elsewhere. 
Um, all right. Thanks again for joining us, folks. Really, really happy you did. Uh, we miss you here, but we're glad to have you online. Take care. See you soon.
Hi folks, I'm Tom Bozine with the quintessential automotive safety tool, the Slash and Smash. Escape easily in the event of an emergency in your vehicle with the Slash and Smash automotive safety tool. It slashes, it smashes, and it has a built-in flashlight. Easily slash through your seatbelt if you're stuck in a vehicle. Smash your windows if you're stuck in a vehicle where the doors won't open. If you're stuck in the dark, there are three settings for your flashlight, so you'll be safe and sound year round. The Slash and Smash easily secures to your visor or to your console with the 3M back sticky backy tapey. But wait, there's more! Buy today and your logo will be printed on the Slash and Smash at no additional charge. Transportation companies, trucking companies, sales teams, anyone who drives all the time will benefit from the Slash and Smash. So whether you're driving for work or play, the Slash and Smash will save the day. I'm Tom Bozine. Stay safe, everybody. Hi folks, I'm Tom Bozine with the quintessential automotive safety tool.
because now we're live. All right. Now we're back live again with my main man, Zach Miller. Hey, everybody. Wait, wait, wait. I should have said Zach is back. Zach is back. There's going to be a whole set, a uh, whole feature. We're going to talk about that video one. feature. Zach is back. We'll talk about that. Zach's with BCG. BCG's an unbelievable company. Uh, uh, yeah. One of the members of HPG Brands. Tell us all about you, Zach, and what you got. All right. So I am Zach Miller. I'm director of sales and GM over at BCG. Uh, so BCG, if you haven't worked with us before, what we are known for is our family service. We're family created. Started in 1982 now. Wow. Before you were Sorry, born. 1981. Yeah. A while before I was born. Thank you for aging me there. Um, so we are, so my dad started that company off. My mom joined in a few years later and now me about 10 years ago. So really when you're dealing with BCG, you are dealing with family and there's layers of it in there. Anyone at BCG is going to treat you like family too. So what we specialize in is emblematics, your pins, your keychains, your coins, your ornaments, lanyards, silicone bracelets, patches. 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 We don't need no stinking patches. Is that a thing? Is that no. a movie line? Everybody needs patches. Everybody needs patches. Everybody That's needs right. patches. That's right. You can do that. So when, when you're dealing with BCG, you send us a logo. You give us an hour or two. You're going to get your virtual back nice and easy. We are going to make emblematics fun and super sexy. So now let's talk about lapel pins. Why don't we start? So let's start. when you're talking about a lapel pin, again, give us an hour or two. You've got your virtual. It's quick. It's easy. It's simple the way it's got to be. Now that pin is going to go from your backpack onto your cork board, onto your jacket at an event, onto your lanyard. I'm going to even show this in close up here so you can see. This is here. Your lanyard is covered with It is covered. Pens. So, yeah, And you know what? Here. What's really fun, actually, I don't know if this is in. Is it zoomed in right now? Don't worry about zoom. She'll <laughs> get it for you. So, so just keep what it we're steady. doing here, you can see all of these different pins of Walter. And it's Walter is the BCG spokes dog. So this is one really cool way to do pins. Make them fun. Take a single logo, make it themed. Uh, so you've got some spring season there, some winter season. We do a different one for every trade show. If you're here at PPAI or if you've got any friends here, send them over. Get your Vegas-themed Walter pins. Ooh, Vegas They're really Walter. cool. Oh, yeah. We love Vegas, Walter. Now, what you can also do with your pins, put it on a nice really – you could do it on a nice card, one pin, turn it into a set of pins. This is a really nice deluxe premium piece that we've done. And you can see – Really nice, heavy cardstock, multiple pins in there. And our art team is going to work on you the whole way uh, on it with you the whole way through. If you don't have too much art, send us what you got. We will work on it with you. Uh, and let's talk about some of the new stuff. So pins, keychains, coins, it's all the classic, and we do it to perfection. Some of our new stuff, though, released last year at PPAI was the Soft Side Collection. So one of my favorites from it is this guy right here. We can't use zoom on this one. This one's way too big. It is the oh, yeah. 60. Here. I'll hold one side. You hold All right, the other. let's do it. 60 inch wide, full die sub round towel. You can have that with or without the fringe on the edge. Uh, and that one there, phenomenal detail. Nice and soft. Great oh, for picnics. Walter. We love Walter. He's on everything. Love Walter. I hope you have We've a Walter that. in your life, everybody, to, to put on a. a you should have a Walter. Walter. Everyone should have a Walter. I can't imagine life without a Walter. Oh. We've got our dice up socks. That made me feel a little bit sad, like in the future, oh. if Walter's not here and when you, you know. Walter will always be. Here. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. So, dice up socks. So, you can do that with a lap band, nice touch to it. And what's really awesome about our socks, what we love, yeah. you can put that, you can stretch it out. Wow. Yeah, Check let's that show out. The, that. Check out how stretched out the graphic is not going anywhere. I made my groomsmen actually wear our socks on my wedding day. I had my cat all over them. So that tells you how comfortable I am with how incredible that quality is. So take a look. Really awesome piece here. And again, if you've got friends here at PPAI, make sure they come by the booth, get their samples of these awesome BCG socks. Oh, we're giving away samples of the socks. We are. Okay. This specific one. For those of you at home, if you need samples from BCG, what's sample policy, Zach? Sample policy. We have tons of random samples. You hit us up with an email. You cover shipping. Samples on us. On our wood products, which I'm going to show you some of soon, spec samples are no charge. You send us the Vector logo. It's on us. There's one or two exceptions, and that's it. Any of our wood products, you let us know. We will get those set up that's for you. That's amazing. Last thing I want to show from last year's soft quick, side though, Real quick, yeah. it's amazing to do a custom, you know, spec or a custom piece of basically art. Yeah. For free and get it to people. It's so our quickly. pleasure. That's unbelievable. Well, this is one of the exceptions, but I'm just saying, <laughs> no one can see what I was. Holding. No one can see. You're right. I shouldn't have said that. So before I talk about our new stuff, 
That's okay. We're live, man. Things Hold happen. On. Oh, thanks, Mel. We got it. <laughs> Mel D, thank you. I am so sorry, everybody. One of my favorites from our release last year is our full die sub cooler bag. So that guy there, you can have six cans in there. Use it as a lunchbox. Uh, yeah, I love this piece. You've got all six sides covered. Full die sub. Really Let's nice see. piece there. All right. So I know the question a lot of people have. By the way, ask questions if you need it, if you need to. A lot of people will think this is a fully custom thing. It's, this is going to yeah. take, what, several months? That's, right? No, How that's going to take three, four weeks. Three to four weeks yeah, that's it. from order to delivery. That's it. That's wild. Yeah. A month. Pretty quick. That's unbelievable. Yeah. I think so. Well, no. I mean. I think so. I you're incredible. Too. I too. No, you're incredible. No, you are. incredible. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> Zach's mom. <laughs> Sharon just said Zach's incredible. All right. Now, what you're all here for, let's talk about... Wouldn't it have been you. wild if she said, you're not incredible? That would have been crazy. Sorry. <laughs> let's not go there. <laughs> you are let's incredible. not go there. So, <laughs> so let's talk about the brand new from BCG. So we've got our recycled corn fiber tote. All four sides covered. We've got full dice up on all four sides. I'm going to actually show the zoom in camera. I want to show... Yeah, yeah. On our samples that we've got here, you've even got that whole cycle. So it goes from the corn, you've got the cob, you've got the uh, the husk, all turned into that PLA, developed into the product, and then still biodegradable. Yeah. Oh, really wow. okay. fantastic eco alternative. Yeah. So we want to keep that in mind. Now that print on the side, on the on the yeah, uh, that that's something we have for display to show people the process. Yeah. But they don't have to. They don't have like, to do that. Do no. full they everything. could if they want. We have the artwork ready. Perfect. Up to them. Yeah, that's, that's actually a great value add to clients who I want to know so. about that, right? Yeah. Love it, love it. Great piece. Now, where are we going to next? We're going to our layered wood ornaments. So this one here, right. this was a hit for this holiday season. It's going to be an even bigger hit next year as we've developed even more. So I don't have much light back here, but so. Oh, it's, uh, it's like translucent. Right here, they're translucent. So the you've light. got that bottom layer of acrylic. Nick's going to join let's in here some. with I've a, got an idea. Yeah, let's do it. Ooh. That's it, right? Don't move so fast. So fast. There you go. <laughs> so these guys here, completely, completely custom shape the acrylic. It's full. It's any design you want. You can print spot color on there. Any design. There's no limits. Custom shape on the acrylic on the back and the wood or both. Either one, whatever you'd like. You could do that as a layered wood ornament here, with an acrylic cover and glitter. That's and that's. That's a really fantastic Yeah, this one. like 3D sort of depth that you add to this. This oh, looks and... like an unbelievably like detailed piece. That now just wait what I'm about customers. to show, and that's our brand new layered wood coasters. Okay. So the layered wood coasters, you can do this engraved. You can do it print up to four layers in there. You can do more layers, less layers, whatever you'd like to do. There's absolutely no limits. This one here that I'm going to show, that's a map of Canada. You could do a stadium in there. And you could do it again, laser engraved or print. My finger is in the way. We're going to move it there. And those there, quick turnaround too. I know that's what you're going to be asking. It's only about two, three weeks, maybe three, two, in that area. Um, so that's what's new and great from BCG. What I want to also tell you about, though, if you're not following BCG on Instagram and Facebook, you are going to miss out on some great opportunities this year. We're going to be coming to you live with the Zach is Back series once a week. What's that all about? I'm going to tell you. Okay. <laughs> so once a week, we're going to be coming to you with a brand new, awesome, innovative idea. You can show your clients with one of BCG's products. And that's, hey, Zach, that's we have a question. It. Tell I, me. I think that's me. I'm, I'm going to be a subscriber to Zach is Back, right? I, I mean, I'll I, be your first subscriber. Please. Um, we have a question from Annie. She said, which socks did you just show? What, what is the this one item here, number or name? This one here is the SUB360C. Another favorite is the SUBS3 and SUBS5. Got it. I just typed in SUB3603. SUB360C. C. C. Annie, I messed up. Three, Thanks for six, the question, zero, Annie. C is the name of the sock. It really did stretch yeah. really perfectly. Oh, it's you can phenomenal. See that. Um, you can wear it as a glove if you want to. Shall we put it on? Yeah, let's go. I'll put you put yours, mine on. I'll put yours on. <laughs> All right. There we go. There we go. Can we high five with them? Oh, I'd love that. Wait, we'll go. B C G. 
un that was unscripted. That was totally off the cuff. If you can believe that. that <laughs> Do we have any top. other questions? Because we need the material. <laughs> no, no. I think I think I think you said it all. Fantastic. And for those of you who didn't know BCG before this, or just learning about BCG, unbelievable company who does unbelievable things, as Zach showed. So uh, please send in uh, information, sample requests. Yeah. And subscribe absolutely. to Zach is back. Follow BCG on Instagram and Facebook, and of course, HPG Brands. And any questions, bcg.info at hpgbrands.com. Our team is ready. You will get answers quicker than you expect. I promise you that. Love it. Thanks, Zach. Can't Thanks, wait everybody. Till you're back. And we'll be back in just a few minutes. Thanks, everybody.
Hi folks, I'm Tom Bozine with the quintessential automotive safety tool, the Slash and Smash. Escape easily in the event of an emergency in your vehicle with the Slash and Smash automotive safety tool. It slashes, it smashes, and it has a built-in flashlight. Easily slash through your seatbelt if you're stuck in a vehicle. Smash your windows if you're stuck in a vehicle where the doors won't open. If you're stuck in the dark, there are three settings for your flashlight, so you'll be safe and sound year round. The Slash and Smash easily secures to your visor or to your console with the 3M back sticky backy tapey. But wait, there's more! Buy today and your logo will be printed on the Slash and Smash at no additional charge. Transportation companies, trucking companies, sales teams, anyone who drives all the time will benefit from the Slash and Smash. So whether you're driving for work or play, the Slash and Smash will save the day. I'm Tom Bozine. Stay safe, everybody.
It is recycled out of ocean-bound plastic. It is USA made and it is decorated in-house. So great product. Cool thing with this is, is it fits a plethora of items. I'm gonna show it over here on this yeah. camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this thing can fit cans, cups, bottles, slim cans, wine cans. If they're wine cans. Well, I guess they have wine cans. They have can wine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So if uh, you just saw what Lee did, he just took this eco freak and stretched it really easily over this. This is an empty can, but and 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 the print didn't really change. Like it stretched a little bit, but the, you don't see lines. It's a really yeah. nice print. We did a lot of work just kind of reformulating the product to get it to where when it stretches, you you can still read it. Yeah, I've let's seen, get. I'm we've gonna, seen socks that stretch out and you can't read them anymore. Yeah, see, Jeff showing. Yeah, it in there here. we go. We'll move it up so, here. Go ahead and slide that bad boy on there. You want me to do it? Yeah, just you pop, trust just me? pop it on. All right, let's go. You can't mess it up. Eco, oh my Boom. gosh, it goes right over that. that. Stretches. Now, Lee, like, why why do I need this for my water bottle? Well, you always want to have your own branding on everything. That's your customer true. wants their logo everywhere. Yep. You want to absorb your condensation. You want to show off your team pride, your colors, whatever it is. And I it's love a promo that. product. So, the condensation is the thing I didn't even think of. Like when yeah. you're when it, the cold. When yeah, it's no one wet. wants sweaty hands or wet cold hands. So yeah. to keep your hands warm, you know, whenever the drink's cold and vice versa. Yeah, that's you know, awesome. You can put it over a coffee cup if you just want to have extra grip. Yeah. Um, hey, so yeah. What is this made out of, by the way? So this is made out of ocean-bound plastic. Um, it's recycled out of. Uh, Bottles pulled out of the ocean. Oh wow! So, um, it's great, sustainable yeah. product. Great you know? sustainability. That's, that's what we right. want to come into. So leading into that, we are also coming out with the brand new Neo Green. Um, that's trademark patent. I was going to do the Ricky Bobby thing. Do it. So the Neo Green Coolie is uh, is our brand new neoprene recycled coolie. Mm. Um, it's eighty one percent recycled material. That's the that's one percent higher than some of the competition. Oh wow! So uh, this will be new. This is coming out this spring. Um, we just got all the approvals and all the samples done. So that's Amazing. brand new. Unveiling it at the show. Amazing. And then our other product that was last year's top seller. It's still the best seller is the Cappy. Um, we offered the Cappy by itself or a Cappy Coolie combo. Cool thing about the Cappy is it works two ways. Do we yeah. want to show them on this camera? Yeah, let's show them on this camera uh, how the Cappy works. That's, that's good so idea. Cappy, it's great. Let's it's show. Easy. Let's show them what the Cappy looks like real quick. It's USA made. Hopefully, I'm in. It's a little. Yeah, yeah you're I'm good up there. here. You're like. All right. Hey, this is my first time. No, so. you're good. You're good. All right. So cool thing is. Use it upside down. You can pop your tab, save your fingernails. That way, you know, women don't break those fancy fingernails. Yeah, right. Then once you flip it over and put it back on, you can twist it around. It becomes a lid for your can. So keeps out any of the dirt, debris, bugs, no more bee stings in the mouth. Yeah. So it's great. Oh, hi. Great We're live right now. You're on. You're on. You're on. You're streaming live. It's good to see you, too. Yeah. All right. All right. So, it's yeah. It's a live I mean, show. It's a live show. That's it. It's a live business. So yeah. Cappy Cooley Combos. The Eco Freak and the Eco Freak Tall, and then the all new Neo Green Neoprene Recycled Cooling. That's amazing. You know, a lot of companies, a lot of our clients are asking us for uh, things that they can add to their CSR, their corporate uh, sustainability right, right. Uh, uh, agenda. Yeah. And I feel like like no one would ever think of these types of products in that world, but we yeah. got it. Yeah. Well, and as HPG, we're always innovating. We have a whole wall over there of sustainable products. Yeah, we do. And, and as you know, times progress, we're going to have even more products. So keep 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 tuned in, and we'll keep coming out with more stuff. For those of you who don't know Lee, he's a very interesting man, and I want to ask him a couple of questions about himself. Lee, what's your favorite color? Black or blue? Okay. Could there be blue? Black? Black, you mix them uh, as long as you don't say black and blue because that sounds violent. Yeah, yeah. And we're all about the love. We, we support the police, you know. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's that's a good angle too. Did a lot of coolies for them. Okay, Lee, uh, if you could pick one best product that you have, you're, you're stranded on desert island. One product that, and, and you have. Here's the twist. You got a can of your favorite beverage. Okay. And you have to pick one best product across the whole brand. Yeah. What would you pick? It'd probably have to be our best coolie. It's it's the Tried number true, one selling coolie. It's been it's been on top of the heap for forever. Well, that's that's so, the right that's the right answer, everyone. Ding ding ding. Lee wins the prize. Yeah. I mean, best is best, man. You're the best. You're the best. No, no. Uh, Lee's the best. This guy. Appreciate this guy. you. Uh, we are um, we're, we're live. I'll, I'll tell you yeah, how it's going in a second. No, this is fun. This is amazing. Okay, this is how a lot uh, works, right? <laughs> well, let's see if anyone has any questions for Lee. Uh, I don't see any questions. If you do come up with questions, everyone, about best, about anything yeah. HVG, please put them in the chat. We're going to... Nick we'll will have the up. answers. I'll, I'll have the answers or I'll find someone who has Sweet. the answers. Sweet. Now the stage yeah. dive off. You can go wherever you want. I'm going to awesome. say bye. We'll be right back, everyone, in about right. 20 minutes. Thanks, everybody. Segment. Thanks, Lee. Bye, You're the best. Bye, y'all. Hopefully, I wasn't too That painful. was amazing. No, that was great.
All right, we're back live again. Well, we're live all day, but we're live in person with someone who I really admire, who's going to talk about some really amazing things. Uh, really quickly, this is Eric from Mixie, actually from HPG. Eric's just got a promotion. He's the man. Um, <laughs> Eric's going to specifically today be talking about Mixie, which is our self-care line. Uh, if you have any questions for Eric while we're talking for us, please jump in the chat and ask us. Um, we'll answer them live here, get all the answers to you. You've got some really cool stuff here uh, to show, Eric. Where do you want to start? I do. I want to start with the new craft, uh, craft Paper Lip Moisturizers. This one is probably the one I'm the most excited about. It's our best-selling category. If you know Mixie, you know Lip Moisturizer. Yeah. It's uh, kind of our bread and butter, and uh, we finally found a zero-waste sustainable solution. Wow. So those plastic tubes, as great as they are, kind of can be a mess sometimes. So we were able to get our new craft paper tubes, yeah, and they so are good. absolutely fantastic. Zero waste. After you break that safety seal, you push it up, just like those good old-fashioned sherbet push pops that I everybody have loves. one right here. Look. You've got one right here. You push it up, yeah, like a push pop. Like a push pop, yeah. So the what? best part is you finish that up, yeah. and when you're done, toss it in the recycling. Zero waste. The paper is fully, the packaging is fully recyclable. Fully recyclable, yep, That's absolutely. Amazing. That's amazing. Well, is it going to leak, Eric? It's not going to leak. Is it going to leak through the paper? Okay, it that's will not a, leak. We have perfected a, that, and we are in a spot to, to produce today. That's amazing. Yeah. A sustainable solution in lip balm. Who would have known that was something that... You know, uh, there's always something. There's always yeah. something, Eric. That's there's always right. something. That's yeah. great. I love it. Perfect. Let's show that. What else you got up here? All right. Uh, next, I want to move on to a couple of the new stress balls. This is the fastest growing category at Mixie within our personal care and health and wellness. Do you think that's because people are stressed, Eric? Do you think do you think these fine people had a stressful 2023? You know, I've talked to a few people who had mentioned they might have been a little stressed. Yeah. And I, I can kind of echo that sentiment. Yeah. yeah. It was it was a oh. stressful year. We got through it together, though. We did. Together. Sorry, I, a little side note there. <laughs> it's I a great side note. Yeah, you've got, so Nick, you're holding the, the Mala Cool. This is called Mala Cool. Get it? It like looks a molecule, kind of, but yeah. it's cool. It looks, yeah, yeah. So, so me, that one is great. With the, you got your primary colors, and that feels pretty good, right? Squirming oh it around. Man. It's so satisfying. Yeah, as my twelve-year-old daughter would say. Yes, yes. This is really cool. These, these, uh, there's a. Uh, how do I say this, Eric? These, these balls are really nice and firm. Yes. So, uh, so yeah. I, uh, they, when I squeeze them, <laughs> yeah, they, it feels they, really nice in my hand. It's, uh, it's great. It's a satisfying, it's a satisfying stress ball. It fully engages that sense of touch. Yeah. Mala cool. That, that's super cool. It looks awesome. I love Ma that. Mala cool. Mala so cool. Uh, the other one, which is my personal favorite so far this year, is the Pearl Swirl. Pearl Swirl. And as you can see, these do come in a nice packaging, each oh, piece. Yeah. But the Pearl Swirl, you know, it kind of speaks for itself. Ooh. Very, very cool. You get Here, that ocean-like, yeah, oceanic swirl to it. You can see all the swirly. It looks like Saturn or something. Looks like a planet. It's some wow. nice, some nice galaxy-like features, some yeah, nice ocean-like yeah, yeah, features. Yeah. I love that. That's so really. I, cool. I love that one as well. And uh, you know, we're going to keep building on that category because, as Nick mentioned, we're stressed out, but we're working through it together. There's your solutions that help for that. That's so right. So we're going to keep building off that. Self-care at its finest, Eric. It is. It really is. How are you feeling in here, by the way? How's the temperature for you? Temperature feels good. I'm I a little hot. I'm a little warm. Are you? You're I'm feeling warm. warm. I don't know how to, how do you cool off? Like fans work, but like I need cold air in the summertime. How do I do that? You know, that's a fantastic question. And we have just the solution for that. Do you? Yes. We've got our Easy Freezy fan. So easy Freezy. Not to be confused with last year's model, the Easy Breezy. The Easy Freezy is going to ensure cold air being blown in your face. How does it do that, Eric? Well, I'm glad you asked. <laughs> So we have a cooling plate built into the, the top of the piece uh, next to the fan. So as you, you press it here, you've got three speeds. Nick seems like a three-speed guy. I'm a three-speed Yeah. Let's show the camera. This is the plate Eric was talking about to those watching on the side cam. And this place, a plate actually kind of freezes and gets cool to the touch. Yep. And the air blowing out yep. is cold. And it feels great. Oh, and, man, uh, really you know, cool. some fans, say you're outside. We're in Las Vegas. It gets hot here. That feel, feels looks like so it feels good. great. Feels so good. Um, you know, the, some fans are just going to blow hot air around. This cooling plate will get you a nice cold blast. So that's kind of kind of the point of the freezy part of the Easy Freezy name. Yeah. There's a little snowflake freezer button here. When you hit that, that's when you feel the, the cold air. Yep. There it is. Ooh. It feels great. <laughs> Now you're good, yeah. You got the blazer on, that helps. You just get a little quick right. little blast. That's the easy freezy personal fan. Uh, this is really it's a really nice, like substantial product. Nice heavy duty. Last piece on it too. Oh. A little hidden feature. 
it pops out. You got a ring and a carabiner clip on there. So, you know, you need to hook cool. that. Hook it to your backpack. Hook, hook, it to your... hook it to your backpack. I like to be outside. I like to hike. Throw it on the backpack. Throw it on my belt loop. It's going to work. You're so cool, Eric. You know, yeah, I, I easy, game. Easy, easy, okay. easy. Yeah, I get it. I get it. I play it. <laughs> All right, okay. what else? What else is down the line? So here? I've got a couple more. Um, I want to show this one. This is our brand new uh, golf ball massager. So golf obviously is big. Everybody loves golf. Everybody loves massages. This kind of hits both a little bit. But you know, if you're like me, sometimes if I have a knot, I'll use like a, a softball or a golf ball, and it gets a little rigid and it's kind of goofy if you're rolling on the ground or up against the wall. This is in here uh, loose enough but tight enough that it keeps it in place. So you can actually oh, do it, you, know, you can get in there. Do me, Eric. You can get those back. Yes. You can get the back. You can get yes, the knots. Sir. And oh, you can grip it I nice and it. clean. And it feels great. And uh, nice large. Um, yeah, let's show everyone how the golf ball too. looks because it's an actual golf ball in here. So it's got the little dimples. Uh, it's very promo, if you will, for lack of a better term. This is a great golf tournament sort of bag you yep. Golfers do get stiff. Um, so it's a little specific, but I think it's super cute. And, and the little dimples on the ball and the little golf ball is awesome. Yep. And, and it works like a charm, too. So obviously a very good added bonus. Yeah. That's that's amazing. That one's fun. I, um, I don't. Well, this looks extremely interesting to me, Eric. Please explain what this is. Yes. So it looks kind of like a you know like a tail, like a orca like a tail or something tail. like yeah, whale yeah. tail, uh, but it is not. Actually, this is our gravity relaxer. So um, anyone that has been to a chiropractor, maybe you've seen or used or been prescribed this. A lot of people have been using it at home. It's really been trendy lately. I actually ordered one last summer before we brought these in. So maybe if I would have waited, could have been a little bit better. But uh, what it is is, um, it's a piece you lay, you set it on the ground, you lay back, Eric, and you kind of let's try use these out. nodules. Let's see if we can show everyone how it works. Okay. Um, so I need to lay this way. Yep. On my head. Okay. Yep. So you lay on the ground. You got the neck relaxer, Jeff. I don't know if you can get this shot. Oh God, I'm gonna fall. He's gonna fall. I got, I got embraced though. Got embraced. It's, it's hitting my neck in all the right places. Yep. You're finding those nodules, right? Yeah. Those nodules or, yep. or whatever, yeah. So you get these kind of, these will add up to your pressure points a little bit. And I personally, like I have problems once in a while, like craning my neck when I sleep. I've used that. It kind of redistributes blood flow. And you can also feel it like down your spine, kind of helping with posture and realignment. And uh, yeah. kind of like if you're doing a plank, you can kind of feel it there. It's kind of the same sensation, not as difficult as a plank. But it's uh, it's really nice, awesome wellness ad, and one that we haven't seen out there. So we thought, let's be the guys. I think this is amazing. Every company, every corporate entity needs a wellness program. Yes. Uh, uh, and, and things like stress balls and fans and lip balms, these, these are going to make employees happier. Yep. And when you can make products as cool as Ooh, these. See what you did there. I think it's a huge win. Yeah. Thanks, Eric. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. All right. Anything else you want to leave us with? What are you excited about this year from moving forward? Moving forward, I'm excited to, to keep uh, adding to the brand. You know, we, we've been uh, rebranded two years, Mixy, and we finally feel like we're starting to pick up steam. And I, it's thanks to all of you guys for all the great projects, building these relationships. I'm looking forward to continuing that yeah. and to uh, helping you with solutions. And, you know, if it's something we don't have, ask me. We can probably do it. Ask Eric. Yes. That, that's sort of the theme at HPG. You don't know? Ask Eric. You're going to get flooded. Your inbox get yeah. flooded now. Yeah. Just in general inquiries. That's good. I can do it. Send it my way. All right. Um, well, I don't see any any chat questions. If you do have those questions coming up, everyone, let me know. Oh, here's a little teaser, too. Uh, we're, we're live streaming today. We're going to live stream tomorrow, and Eric's going to be back. Yes. Eric's coming back with me. We're going to have a mobile cam. We're going to be in the mixy section of our booth that has a neck massage area and all the products. So we're going to do sort of a live feed from... Uh, what's happening in the booth. That's going to be really, I can't wait to do that with you. That's I'm great. excited. Yeah, that's going to be fun. So tune in tomorrow for that too. That's going to be, be cool. good. Yeah. All right, everybody. What time is it? It's almost 20 till the top of the hour. We'll have another segment. Um, again, questions in the chat, please. Uh, if you're watching this live and you want more information on any of the products in our booth, you can go to hpgbrands.com slash PPAI. And we have a whole page dedicated to not only the show, but we'll have a, a segment with all the new products or a section, I should say, with links to all the new products in the show, including all these great ones that Eric showed. Um, so please go there for more detail. Uh, love it. Thanks, Eric. Great Thank job. You. Thank you. Appreciate uh, it. We'll be right back soon, everyone.
because you're you're training. Hey, buddy, Zach from BCG here. If you've got any friends here at PPA, send them over to the BCG booth. Get them to take a picture in front of our BCG pin wall and hashtag BCG pin wall. Five lucky winners are going to win 100 free self promo pins on a card. I'm going to get mine right now. Come on in here. I'm going to get mine with Trina. There we go. Thanks, guys. Oh, I didn't actually take a picture because my phone didn't work so quick. Right. Thank you.
You're good. Are we Everyone's ready? Everyone's good. I think we're ready. I think good. we're, we're okay. back. Everybody's Sharon good. Sharon Huber, my buddy Nick. Everyone knows who you are. You don't have to introduce yourself. Everyone, we're back live. This is Sharon, of course. Um, Sharon's going to talk to us about the new stuff from Batch and Bodega. Um, but before she goes, I'm going to remind you, please get in the chat. Ask any questions you have. That's and, right. Uh, I love questions. She, I may not always know the answer, but I love questions. You may think she's joking or being sarcastic, but no, she really I'm does not. love questions. That's love a, that's a, that's he a asked fact. me so many questions. So I'm ready for it. He loves me, though. Okay, question okay. one. Okay. What's new at Batch and Bodega? Oh, we have so many new kits. Now, just as a reminder, normally you would see all of our Batch kits in these great boxes, all different boxes like the Speakeasy, and we have Munch Appreciated. This one happens to be the Act Natural. But we've changed things up a little bit. But before I go on to that, this is a great piece. This came out in Q4 last year. So if you haven't seen it, Act Natural is actually kind of like our eco type of kit. So you yeah. see branding right here. And in here, you get your lovely glass bottle bamboo top. This is from Debco. See that nice laser etch? Let's show very, here. Very, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, no, don't apologize. You might be able to see it in the camera. Let, yeah, there's a secondary camera right here. Oh. So we can do tied that. up shots. There's a laser etching on this and, and glass, like Sharon said. So this bottle is really, really nice. We also have, I'll be your Vanna White. Yeah, you be my Vanna. Laser etched stainless steel copper straw color. Very nice. Then you have this great journal. This is a linen and cork journal from Debco. Awesome piece. So Sharon's talking about all these materials that are sustainable, reusable. Right. Uh, they, they tell a little story. Exactly. But the even better part is the snacks are all upcycled. I'm hungry. I know. Do not open that. Okay. I need that. I, I won't open it. Okay. So upcycle. If you're wondering what upcycle snacks are, he better stop laughing. Um, so, for example, you know those ugly potatoes that are kind of gnarly on the bottom that no restaurants will use? Well, Uglies makes kettle chips out of them. Mm. You want those, don't they you? They still taste good, right? Yeah. <laughs> and we have upcycled fruit snacks. Yes. Same same way, right? The grocery store doesn't want this that's pineapple right. that's beat up or oranges or whatever. They, they dry them. They taste, they all eat the same. They just might look different. Right. They're just not pretty fruit. Yeah. You know, they want pretty fruits in restaurants and the grocery store. So... These great companies upcycle, and this is called Act Natural. Act Natural. Uh, you act very natural. Uh, like you're a very natural person, Sharon. Well, I wouldn't say that, but yeah, I'm from New Jersey. That's why. Maybe authentic. You don't is get the... more. Hi. You don't get more natural than New Jersey. Okay. So that's your Act Natural. So remember, we have kit boxes like this, but the new ones for 2024 mm -hmm. are now going to be packed in some additional swag look at that oh so, so we've changed it up to where the packaging is also reusable correct okay so this is our craft tote and this one is called the uh wait a minute this is the festival goer all right everything you need for a festival okay logo there so let's see what's in here you what's see in what's the in? festival goer all right of course your ugly snacks oh yeah these are the best we use these in a lot of kits and then I like this one. These are mango and chili. They got their fruit bites. They got a little kick to them. Little, 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 little kick. Yeah, like that. So you can't have too many of those because, you know. Yeah. And then. Organic, uh, fair And trade, that's one of the stuff. new uh, batch makers we're using. Mm. And another new batch maker is Hydrate. Ooh, what do I do with this? Cheryl? Well, you take your water bottle. Okay. And you pour it in there. And when you're in a place like Vegas, where it, it is so dry, uh -huh. it hydrates you. Should it I make you it more now? energy? Or you can't. You... Well, no, you can't because oh, I'm showing okay. that at the show. What's wrong with you? All right. Now, so we saw all the snacks, right? So now, what else is branded in here? I don't Do you know? know. Let's look. Let's look. So what Ooh. would you need at an outdoor festival? Oh, you need a fan. Yes. So this is your easy breezy fan, branded full color. Got a little carabiner at the end too. I see that, so I can they put it on my. I can put it on my uh, my backpack. Yes, you can. And then, of course, you might just might want to have a drink. So this is a double wall slim cooler. Yes. 
So put your Trulies in there, put yeah. your claws in there. The lid or comes off, you put it in, you screw the lid back on, and it holds the can in there. Yes, nice holds it tight. nice and tight, keeps it nice and frosty for you because it's double wall. That's right. And last but not least is your lip moisturizer in a cube. Again, full color, full color, laser etch, all in this adorable, this perfect is, bag. So we called it the festival goer, but yeah, like you, you, if you have an event, like a corporate retreat or anything, this Absolutely. is all, these are all very functional, usable items okay. for, for everyone attending, right? Yes. Well, good. And who loves the Lululemon bag more than me? Nobody. Okay. Uh, Alex Sims, I, I think. Um, okay. He, so, he loves, he loves Lululemon <laughs> so much. So, now, he was talking about, you know, having a corporate event. Well, this is a perfect room drop. And you like that? I do. These are Those, reusable storage awesome. bags from Beacon. They're awesome. You this is open? really impressive, it, would you say? Yes. Would you would, would you say this impress, press, presses? And guests? what is the name of it? It's called the Impress press, Your Guests. Yes. Okay. So, I'll open it for in you. here, okay. So your branding goes on that reusable storage bag. Now, don't forget. I we have I will never forget. Merrimix. This is another new batch. Oh, yeah, the Merrimix. Yeah. This lady has a great story, by the way. And, and Sharon said it before, but all these batch makers have a story. It's, it's usually small batch, family owned places. Yes. And, and that's important. Woman owned, family owned, minority owned. Yep. And then we have, of course, Sugar Spot, which he did before he got mad at me because I was late. So he had to do it. Nope. So we have some Sugar Spot in there. And these are uh, peach rings. Yes. And. Nope. You need to hydrate. Are you you're impressing hydrate. your guests right now. Question. Yes, question. Does the pork pen come with the pork and linen journal? Yes, it does. Question. The pen you... is not branded, but the journal is, and it does come with that. All included. Oh, I love questions. That's Give me another question. one. That's a great question. Um, another and question. Then... Uh, Sharon, are you from Jersey? Stop that. Uh, um, <laughs> all right, your branding is here. Mints, and again, lip your square lip moisturizer. And by the way, square lip moisturizer and mints made in the U.S. Yes. That's very important, okay. too. So that was your impress your guests. Impress your guests. All right. I really am loving the, the idea that the packaging is reusable. Um, yeah. This cuts down on some waste, too. The yes. natural kit, that's a recyclable box, box. for sure, which recyclable. is good. But if I'm, I'm going to use the, the, the little baggie. Yeah. What do we call this, it? It's a reusable storage <laughs> reusable bag. You know what else? Bag. This is great for TSA. Perfect uh, size. Put your stuff in there after you eat all your snacks. Yes. So, um, what are we gonna do next? I like well, it. let's. This is called the I, Office Outfitter. It's the Office Outfitter. That sounds nice. Doesn't that sounds it? like uh, somebody Jeff needs to uh, dress him. You know, like outfit well, him, put him in. He uh, with some questionable things down there. The office wearing, but that's okay. So this is our. This is from Best. You know, best they're over there. Yep. You saw them this morning. So this is a 40 ounce double wall. All the bells and whistles of that other brand. Nice laser etch. Now you're saying, well, Sharon, it's only that. What well, else Sharon, do we it's get? Only that. What else do we get? I mean, they're a new hire, an office essential. What else is in here? Well, let's look. Let's look. Okay. Oh. Oh, there's things inside of the tumbler. Wow. That's what, so. This we put it in the bag. These we put in the box, the Ziploc. Now you have it in the drinkware. So we have a pour over pack of coffee. This is from Back Porch Roasters in Oregon. Yeah. What else we have? It? Oh, Stellar, which is a woman owned business. Mm -hmm. uh, these are tasty. Um, hydrate. We're big on the hydrate because we have to hydrate no matter what. You do. We really do. And we have the South Fork. Um, what is this one? This one is Mixed Nut Bar. Yeah. And you're saying, well, is there anything else in there? Is there Absolutely. anything else in there? Oh. We're going to turn it upside down. And in here, we have this great pen, hub pen. Now, you might want to know why those holes are there. Well, let me tell you. Let's show them. Show them the holes. There are little itty-bitty holes in this pen. That's because we use 25% less plastic in that pen. Less because material. Because of those less plastic. Easy peasy. It's the best. We're, we're trying to do our part here. There we go. And then last but not least is from Mixie, it is hand lotion. Because you know, your hands get kind of dry when you're working so hard. So you want to like be us. like us. So that all comes in here, nice and tight, fits. I love it. And these, that's how it's These 40 ounce tumblers are very popular. This looks like uh, familiar. There's like some sort of, I don't know, name brand that 
that makes something like that. I don't know. Like what the, is it? Uh, um, yeah, Rick, Rick, Charlie. Sharon? No, Tony. it's not the Sharon. Oh, how fun would that be if it was the Sharon? <laughs> it would have been fun. <laughs> That'd be fun. You'd be rich at this point. Yeah, that's true. So, you mentioned Hi, Stanley. we're in the middle of a live stream right now. How's it going? That's okay. <laughs> that's all well, right. We're... Oh, Juana. Uh, so, anyway, I got distracted. I get distracted very easily. I'm like a squirrel. So, now we do have Stanley, right? And this is another kit from Batch. And this is called Dress Your Desk. So, and you're saying, is it only Stanley? No. Your logo, Laser Edge here, only in charcoal. I'm going to open up this Stanley. Hold up. And in here, you're going to have that same awesome pen with the holes. You're going to have the coffee. You're going to have the hydrate. And you're going to have the pretzels. So this seems very similar to that. Very idea. similar, except... You're elevating it using a Stanley piece. That's right. This is an official Stanley uh, tumbler that everyone's asking for. Yes. So, so it's almost like a price point kind of correct uh, level difference. Perfect for anyone. Anywhere. So anyone. Well, you really should rename this to Sharon. Because we should. I'm thinking about that. I'm going to talk to Bess. Maybe they'll change that. Exactly. All right. I have one more. Is that okay? Uh, oh, anything for you. You can go all day. Everyone. Okay. Uh, so, see here. Here's a question. Can Sharon just stay on here all day? Yeah. Okay. I can. Well, no, I can't. So this, this one, now I forgot the name of this one. Oh my goodness, Sharon, where is it? I don't have my glasses on. So now I got to put my old lady glasses on to see. This one is meeting essentials. Okay. Okay. So, so back to the boxes. Remember the boxes? So this box, you get to imprint the top and the front of the sleeve. A lot of space. A lot of that's space. A lot of space. A lot of space. I'd say that's okay. a lot of space. A lot of space. Take that off. This is the box. And what do we do? Ooh, there we go. So, you know, we do get a note card, but we get this awesome new journal. It's a little notebook. Yeah, it's, I don't know it's if you made can with fruit fiber. This fruit is a fiber. Uh, sustainable uh, product. It's actually a product that uh, Handstands is carrying. Um, it's really, really neat little Great fruit, item. Fruit now, fiber notebook. This one is coming soon. So this one will be available in March. Now, there's always snacks. Hydrate. We're doing some stellar. And again, remember, it's a little spicy, but it's the mango chili. So all of that in this great kit. But so, we're telling a story here. Um, that there are a lot of great things in here, but the price point on this has got to be really high, right, Sharon? No, yeah. it's not. All of these kits, with the exception of Stanley, are all under $40. Under $40. Honestly, Honestly yeah. really low minimums and, and just a, yep. a really like elevated approach to exactly. something that's still not a crazy price point. So what else do you want to talk about? I would like to know, yeah. Sharon, what stay here talk to them i'm going to get some real quick stay here okay so if you have any other questions on batch we have a whole bunch of other new kits that i didn't bring up here because i thought i only had so much time and i didn't want to empty the booth out oh here he comes he's going to yes um oh uh sorry did i interrupt no oh no no, no. yeah i would like to know hang on one second I'm just kidding. I don't want to know anything else. He is I'm going so to see. Fresh. I want to see. Um, and so something clean. else too, but I can't say that. On what? Did you say something? Oh. Nope. No more questions. No questions. No more questions for you, right. Sharon. Batch. This is Comes. Batch and Bodega 2024. We're telling Let the story. Let us know what you need. We yep. are there for you. That's right. All and right. everybody, we'll be back soon. It'll probably be Sharon again. We'll never know. Nobody really knows, even though there's a schedule. Not coming back. Oh. That's oh, maybe one. Oh. Maybe, maybe, one more maybe one more time. All right. Just for fun. I hope you do. Thanks, everyone. Stay tuned. Thank please you. please Bye. keep watching. We've got. Uh, this is the 40 the ounce kit. quencher the kit. kit. So it's called Dress Your Desk. BB Desk is the item number. I'll put it in here. Only available in charcoal gray. Laser edge. Thanks, Sharon. <laughs> All right. Thanks, yeah. everyone. Bye. <laughs> All right.
Remember where that chair went? <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, All God. right. Beautiful. Everybody yeah. comfy? I think yeah, so. This is great. This is going to be so much fun. Yay. I'm very about this. Yep. All right, everybody. Thanks. Hey, we're, welcome back. Again, we're live from the HPG booth at PPAI, PPAI Expo 2024. Um, this is a very special segment. All that you've been watching, we've been doing product segments, which have been great. Uh, but I have some really like, amazing women. I know all these three people personally. Uh, and I wanted to do this segment because they all have a certain, uh, let's say, aesthetic or style. They're very successful promotional products distributors. Um, but they do things slightly differently. They've, they've got... They've, yeah, they've got the style. So thank you for joining me. I'm going to introduce everyone. This is Natalie O'Leary with Bamco in the end. Hi. Amber George from Boundless. And Lauren Esser, especially incentives. These Hi. are, thank you. Just thanks for joining me. This thank is, you. This thank is you for really asking. Special. This is a treat. Um, as you guys can see, these are very trendy uh, ladies. Um, this segment's called Promo Aesthetic. And I think, I think we can all relate to um, making our clients feel a certain way with product or with our marketing campaigns we build for them. So I have a question uh, for all of you guys. The first question is, um, what does having a certain aesthetic mean uh, to you guys? And why is it important for, for working with clients in that way? Uh, Natalie, I'll let you go first. Oh, I get to go first. Okay. <laughs> um, I mean, I think ultimately by you ha like bringing what you love and feel like is neat and cool to whatever you're, you're doing to your customers, um, it really just offers them a perspective that you get to see like behind the curtain for them to have like out in front. And so I just really love um, being able to show what I like and show what's do doing well and, and that's really neat out there. And um, ultimately it's it's something that will hopefully, you know, make them get to what they're trying to do. I am not doing very well. Oh my God, I'm doing great. What do I even say? I don't know. You go, Amber, you, you can. Uh... Well, one thing what I'm hearing you say is like, you're relating to your clients and, yeah. and I'll move to Amber now. Do you think trust as far as aesthetic in your style, do you think do you think this builds trust with your clients when you when you can relate to them in this way? Yeah, so you're talking specifically about like kind of social media aesthetics and putting our brand social media out there. Aesthetic or yep. the, the way you put your brand out okay. there, but the way you can also apply that to your clients and help them to grow their brand. Yeah. Okay, well, I think for, for, for all of us, what we do is really fun. So it's kind of the opportunity to put that out there in a creative way. And I think, honestly, that's how the three of us found one another was yeah. through Instagram and our connections there and mm -hmm. my admiring the things that Natalie does and the things that Lauren does. So I feel like it's been a really great connector for us. And I feel like yeah. from an aesthetic perspective, mm -hmm. if you're putting out there the things that you like and the things mm -hmm. that we like about our industry yeah. and about our products, and we're naturally attracting the people that kind of connect exactly. with that aesthetic. So, so much I better totally said than what I was saying, but that was my point. <laughs> yeah. No, I completely agree. That's I was going to say that too. Like, I feel like my kind of social media is more a reflection of my own personal style and the customers that I want to attract. And so then if you are putting things out there and sharing ideas that resonate with a certain customer, then that'll just be a more successful partnership because right, you'll have fun together and you... You get excited about the same things and yeah. that kind of stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. and also an opportunity to kind of elevate the products that we sell, right? Yeah. Like showing people using it like as a lifestyle tool or right. in your everyday life or how we use it in, yes. in business. So I think it's kind of an opportunity to elevate yeah. this industry. Right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That's the ultimate yeah. goal. Yeah. So here's a funny story. Not a funny story. This is a really interesting story about why they're here today, especially. And you guys kind of just hit on it during the pandemic. A lot of us were using social media a lot more and, and utilizing it in different ways than we did before, connecting in a different way. And these three ladies connected because they had something that bonded them. They, they, something, yep. you know, it's an aesthetic, it's a style, yep. maybe a vibe, whatever it yep. is. And none of them had met each other in person until <laughs> today. Yeah. 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 But they yeah. connected so to each then. other because of this totally. privacy. And I think that kind of gives me like goosebumps in a way. It's pretty neat. Yeah. Um, awesome. I think that's the spirit of the industry we work in too. It's yeah. the emotional, you know, how, how that makes people feel. Yeah. Um, so would you all say it's it's pretty important that um, that your clients share that this sort of value? I mean, you've already kind of hit on it, but is it important to you that you can kind of relate on a, on a values level with your, with your clients too, Lauren? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I mean... If I'm excited about a product and passionate about something and that goes back to like that means something to the client, then we're just going to have a better working partnership over time and like do more together. And so when I started my Instagram page during the pandemic, 
I was seeking out um, supplier ideas and following the people and following you ladies, like people who inspired me. And so I want to be that for my client yeah. and then help inspire them to do amazing things to grow their brand too. So. Yeah, absolutely. Amber, your group, Boundless Collection, certainly does that as well. Is that where you lead when, when you post social media posts in the way that you market your, your own brand? Is that in order to attract a certain kind of client? Definitely. I mean, I think part of it is we're natural creatives, and that's what draws us to this business. So that's a really fun creative outlet. Mm -hmm. I would say we haven't talked about that being true for all of us. So, yeah, I think my goal in, in posting or taking photos or sh videos or whatever the case may be would be to kind of show um, – what I enjoy about the business and hopes yeah. of attracting other people and then yeah. just from us marketing ourselves in a certain way to kind of share with clients how they can also use tangible products to yeah. bring mm -hmm. their, their self as well. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right. Cause it all goes back to just relationships as we know, and if they can count on us to bring them really cool, creative ideas. Um, that was sort of my same premise of starting my Instagram account. Um, and it's just been, it's been a wonderful way to connect with other people in the industry, connect with suppliers. Um, and it's just, it's been so fun to showcase what this industry is about because people need to understand how awesome it is to be in this industry and the really awesome partnerships that we have, like people like HPG and what we can offer that's different and unique. And mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, that for me has been the biggest thing that I've enjoyed. Yeah, I love it. This, that story just makes me happy when I think about it. So yeah. thanks again for being here. Um, you all have built your businesses and your style over a course of the year. You're all very young women. Let's establish that. Um, but, you know, to build a successful business takes a little bit of time. Um, how have you got to this point? When you first got into promo, was it, I know exactly how I'm going to do this? Tell me, uh, talk about, um, Amber, I'll let you start. Talk about how you got from point A. We've talked about this too. Point A, when you first started promo to here and, uh, and what that means. Well, I am the old goat in the room. <laughs> <laughs> So, beautiful. So I've been doing it a little bit longer than these two lovely ladies. But um, yeah, I mean, I think what attracted me to the business initially, I was in meeting planning and I really loved kind of the gifting side of that business. So um, finding the right products, uh, fitting for the client was very attractive to me. So that's kind of what got me into the business. And definitely when I started, I feel like for me, it took about three years to really hit my stride. Um, and things were a lot different then. I mean, yeah, I yeah. started with a stack of catalogs mm -hmm. and a phone book. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, literally. So yeah. it's a little different. And um, the way products were displayed were just different. Yes. Yeah. So you had to kind of put out images yeah. and yeah. the aesthetic. That, yeah. yeah. And it, even like online presence. I mean, uh -huh. having like a web store. I mean, that was just very new. When yeah. I, I started just not to sound like I was, you know, a, started this industry in the 80s, but I started yeah. in 2001. <laughs> yeah. So that was a really long time ago and a lot has changed. So when evolving with that. Sorry. Been, no, no, no. When did you hit the point, when did you build Boundless Collection? Uh, no, we just yeah, yeah. that. So yeah. I, I joined Boundless Network in 2006, and I probably started my own brand, Boundless Collection, within Boundless, probably about five years ago. Mm -hmm. um, and, and primarily, it was just to kind of differentiate myself and our team uh, from the other 150 reps that represent Boundless, just kind of having that channel. Yeah. 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 Allie, um, as someone, you were for Bamco, and you're building, you, you're someone who... I don't want to speak for everyone, but I think you've kind of come up onto this scene Definitely. In, the, in this world pretty quickly. <laughs> yes. And so, like, how you know, how did how did you get there, and, and what drives you to build your business the way you do? Well, I, you know, I've been in the industry for 11 years, which is kind of crazy to think about. Um, I started my career in sales as a woman slinging trash. Um, I was an account manager for the second largest waste company in the country, and. Uh, I just always felt like I had creative juices that I wanted to like. I wanted to be able to use, and and while I love that industry, uh, it, it it just wasn't necessarily affording me that in in the way that I would have loved to see it do. And so I came over to promo around nine or eleven years ago, and um and it's just it was so the outlet I was needing. It was like truly like a way to still build relationships with customers, but just make pretty things and i just i just really really enjoyed that and then obviously since coming to bamco it's been an amazing way to be able to really ignite the things that i was wanting to do and present and show i mean our marketing team is incredible and um having their partnerships uh sandra's here uh today she's our vendor relations person just having these relationships with our supplier partners and being able to really build up um the content has been really fun um and i i've just 
I don't make it too, I'm not too serious about it. I just sort of like, as we talked about, like post what I enjoy and what I like and hope that they do too. Yeah. So yeah, it's yeah, been I good. I think a lot of people watching probably can relate to that too. Yeah. It's, it's hard to kind of find your stride, but if you're true to yourself and what you, yeah. love, what you love, it'll yeah. come out For sure. in, in your content. Yeah. I think people like that. When did Definitely. you find your stride, Lauren? When did you figure out kind of the direction you wanted to take your business? Yeah, I think it, it so for me, it was in 2020. I wanted to grow my business because I had been a stay at home mom for a couple of years and I was just ready to kind of ramp things up. And so I started my Instagram page. And at that point, it was more like to keep up with what supplier offerings were there because there were like face masks and PPE and things like that that were coming out yeah. daily. And I needed to stay on top of that for my customers. Um, but then I quickly realized I'm like, oh, my customers are on active on social media and I need to be like engaging with them. And so it was it's about like creating the content that it's just things that like inspire me and make me happy and I think are cool and trending, but then also um, just being engaged with those customers in a more like personal way. Um, that's helped grow my business a lot too, just because yeah. I can see what they're doing, like what events they have coming up and like yeah. literally they're in live time videoing an event that they're doing and I can reach out. So yeah. Mm -hmm. It's yeah, we're, it's a people-driven business. Mm -hmm. right. Your clients For like sure. you and they feel that you care yeah. about them. It's just going to yeah. tighten the relationship. Yep. What's the best project, Amber, I'll start with you again. What's the best, like, what's the project you worked on that sort of most personifies you or your brand? What's your, what's the, like, thing that makes you feel the happiest that you've done professionally? That's, such a, that's, a, that's a big question. <laughs> you've done a lot of things. <laughs> really that's really hard something. question. That's the point of it. You can pick one. Oh, no, <laughs> honestly, we just, this last summer, and it was not for a client, it was more for marketing ourselves, but we did a summer of giving campaign, which kind of speaks to the heart of the Balmas Collection team because we, we wanted to, to seek out suppliers and brands and manufacturers that had some type of give back mission and really highlight those products. But then in addition to that, do kind of a secondary give back as a team to organizations that really that really were kind of at, tugging at our heartstrings. So, you know, Operation Smile, UNICEF Foundation, um, and several others that, that were really close to us. So that was a really great um, campaign for us because we really kind of put our hearts into that and leveraged products to to you know create that mission yeah. and, and really do something that was oh, perfect awesome. so that would yeah. be my proudest probably mm -hmm. and that just happened like yeah. just the last summer so yeah that's amazing yeah. it took me a while to get there <laughs> oh, awesome. i love that uh lauren what's something that you've done in your oh, business that personifies gosh. you and lauren esser branding yeah so one that stands out was a recent one as well it was helping with these five live nation concerts that took place over the course of a year and so it was just so fun because we got to be super creative. They had a nice budget and just wanted like super outside the box things. So we, we kind of strategically plan and I help like execute things at the beginning of the year. But then like also along the way, um, there were a lot of curveballs. Like I actually considered flying at one point to like go and like personally pick up products so that it would arrive on time. Yeah. Yep. So for me, it's just like that's a good example of. How I'll do just about anything for my customers, and yeah, um, I just truly want to be a good partner for them, and I love what yeah. we do. It's so much fun. So yeah. that's great, Natalie. Yeah, for me, I would say it's not maybe as much client facing, but just being able to get involved um, within the company I'm working for with Bamco. Um, you know, right about the time that I started, they started talking about creating a women's organization within our within our company, and so. Uh, I, this year has been my year of volunteering. We were talking about like, you know, locally at our regional um, show and then also volunteering to help with the building of, um, of the swag brand that we are creating uh, within BAMCO, um, which stands for Savvy Women Achieving Goals. Um, nice. And, you know, I'm on their board and it's just been really fun to help design the logo and create the merch that we're going to do and like develop a mentorship program and just like really like figuring out what what we need to help continue to give back to the industry in that way, especially to the awesome women within it. And um, I think those types of things that I've been able to embrace since coming to BAMCO have really been my proudest moments and things I'm just looking forward to continuing to do more of. I love that. All right, so let's recap a little bit. We've established how stylish and trendy you ladies are, <laughs> how creative you all are. If you had one piece of advice to offer someone who wanted to rebrand or, or change or build their brand, one just one starting piece of advice, what would that be, Lauren? Oh, probably. <laughs> I know. That's, 
that's tough. But you know, I think it's just about these being, are the hard hitting questions. They are. It is. You have to remember that one on your list. Was it on there? <laughs> yeah, good question. Um, I think just being true to who you are because if you're showing up and you're passionate about what it is you're doing, you're excited, those cu your customers are gonna feel that excitement. I I think one of the better compliments I got was when I had a customer re meeting recently, they were like, I can just tell how excited you are about yeah. what you do. And I'm like, yeah. yes, yes, like I love awesome. it. And so then you just, you're more top of mind for them and you're just going to have a more successful relationship and partnership. So yeah, yeah. So just be true to who you are. Would you say that's what you would suggest to your customers? I think like so. Maybe, maybe bring out their fire, their inspiration yeah. to like, help them. What are you passionate about? Like, yeah. think about that. Like, maybe you're a veteran and you really want to work with like veteran-owned companies and or and do, you know, yeah. it could be anything. But mm -hmm. just finding kind of what what excites you, I think yeah. that's that's a big thing for me. I think. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Yeah. Amber. I think you said that. <laughs> I mean, I feel like to me, it's kind of like understanding like what is their mission or purpose, and then figure out how to communicate that in a in a digital or illustrative or pro, you know product yeah. way. Yeah, yeah. So that's kind of tying tying your brand to what your true like mission is or the problem you're trying to solve. Yeah, um, and then also just having fun, right? Yeah. I mean, that's the that's why we're all here. I mean, yeah. you know, we yes. like that. It's a fun industry. So. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I, yeah, to piggyback off, off of both of you, I think just to come up with exactly what your focus is and like where you're looking to go as you move forward with your rebrand, um, making sure to stay true to who you are, like you said, um, keep it classic and please keep it simple in a one color yeah. print. You know, like how, how can we like, you know, making sure to keep in mind your promotional merchandise that you absolutely need um, is, is something that I would definitely give as advice to anybody that was looking to rebrand. So no ombre logos. I mean, apparently that's not as popular anymore. It's going away. So yeah. Okay. I've got one last question for you, and it's probably the hardest question, honestly. Okay. okay. I'm ready. And I didn't tell you I was going to ask you this question. It's really tough. Okay. I'll start with Natalie. Oh, God, again? Okay. Do you like people? I love people. <laughs> yeah. I really, I, um, if you meet me for five minutes, you'll know that I'm a people person. It's in my DNA. Um, I just, I love hearing people's stories. That's one of my favorite things about meeting the people I've met over the course of the last year um, through Instagram, through LinkedIn, through social media, through Bamco. Um, I just love getting to know everyone in this industry because we all have such unique stories. But then again, we all have very similar stories and I absolutely think it's fascinating. So yeah. I do love people. Amber? I love people. <laughs> yes, definitely. I think this is a relationship business. It's a service business. And without people, none of it can happen. So I definitely would say I'm a people lover. All right, Lauren, two out of three. <laughs> do you like people? I mean... No. Oh. <laughs> I mean, of course, yeah, yeah. a thousand percent. Yeah. And I just have to say, like, I know I told you this at one point that, like, I just love your energy. And yes, yes this you personally, this is about, personally, this is about yeah. Nick for just a quick yes, second please. because you could be literally like promoting a new sour gummy candy <laughs> and you're dressed as Buddy the Elf. And by gosh, I want to try that candy because. I feel like a kid in a candy store now. And I literally so LOL at you. Like, you, I absolutely laugh out loud. Oh, You're fantastic. You right. are so fun. I so. think it's time to cut. I think it's time to <laughs> I just had to throw that in. Thank you very much. I appreciate Thanks. it. And I appreciate thank you Thank you for having us. This is thank a lot of fun. You. I admire the crap out of all of you. So sweet. And, uh, and uh, thanks again for doing this, everybody. We're going to move on to the next segment in a few. Uh, but Natalie O'Leary. Amber George, Lauren Esser, thank you so much. BFFs for forever. Thanks. 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 We'll be back in eight minutes with another live segment from each of you. Thanks. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah.
All right, everybody. We're back. We're back live for actually our final segment of the day. I hope you like Promo Aesthetic. That was a really great panel. We'll get more information about those ladies to you if you want. Um, uh, but joining me now is uh, the man and the myth and the legend, Spencer Galindo. Uh, he's going to talk about what's new at Org Audio. You might talk about other stuff, too. If I know you, there's going to be some tangents and some some really insightful business detail that you'll have, right? Absolutely. Spencer? Absolutely. Let's Why go. Why don't you tell everyone watching who you really are? Yeah, yeah. I know he said Spencer, but honestly, this is the promo poppy up in the building. You heard that right. Promo poppy up in the building. We're about to hear some new Org Audio stuff. First off, we got the Terratone Collection, sustainability in mind. And you know what? Oh, he did it. Sustainability just got sexy. All right? Okay, all right. So, all right. Take it easy. Oh, no, oh, yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. Thanks for taking me down a notch. <laughs> Anyways, all jokes aside, this is our new tech, ecotech focus line, the Terratone Collection. So Terratone is a rich, earthy color that gives a very grounded appearance. And what we wanted to do here is three main points, right? Sustainability in mind, quality you can count on, and then just having a collective, cohesive collection that you could identify one product from the collection, upsell, cross-sell easily, and have a clear pathway into other components of the collection as well, right? So, for example, let's pull out one of these bad boys. Yeah, so th these all have similar packaging. They look like they fit together well, too. They do fit together pretty well. While I unbox that, you bring up a great point. So the Terratone collection is meant to be modular packaging in nature, meaning that you can identify one piece that your client might like and combine other pieces that are housed together with a packaging sleeve that we don't have pictured here. But essentially, you have three different sizes you can choose from, seven different potential combinations in the packaging itself, allowing you to say, hey, if you like this, this actually comes a part of a package. Um, so you can add, again, it's all about the upsell opportunity and you saying, hey, just an organic pathway to, again, just packing chain all together. And efficiency, really. I mean, we talk about sustainability, but a big key to sustainability, Spencer, I think is efficiency, efficient packaging, efficient use of materials, right? So that's what we're doing here. That's what we're doing. So recycled plastics. This is going to be the Terratone 3 watt speaker. Like I mentioned, recycled plastic. Let's show we also everyone have... right here, Spencer. Oh, got a little right side cam. Yeah, gotcha. I'll hold it for you while you talk if you want. So recycled plastic. We have the recycled leather strap on the top. That will characterize most of the collection, which is going to be all recycled plastic, all recycled leather on each piece. So, so this... Oh, sorry. Sorry, no, you're saying this entire collection is made of recycled plastic. Nice. Okay, I gotcha. Leather. All of yep. this stuff. This is, this is neat. This has a good weight to it, too. It's, I like it's, the... I like the, the the brown on white sort of. The brown on white, it's really earthy and girthy, so it just has a very stable base to it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's right. All right. Okay. All, All right. So that's this one. This that's is called. <laughs> that's the Terratone speaker. So Terratone everything speaker. on the Terratone collection is going to be Terratone and then the yes. product itself. Got yeah. It. We got our fans in the, the crowd just waving and cheering on right now. So we're going to move on to the next product. Spencer fans. Spencer fans. Spencer fans. What do we got next? Do you want to show anything else in this collection? Uh -huh. I like the speaker, but I think people are going to dig this. This is just me. Yeah. I think people are going to dig this. Okay. Boom, sucka, sucka, boom, sucka, boom, sucka, sucka. Okay. All right. No, this is going to be the Terratone headphones. Oh, is that what those are, Spencer? <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, that's, that's sick, yo. Yeah. Uh, sorry. I have a lot of people in the crowd distracting me. Yeah. But all jokes aside, again, you're going to see this recycled leather and then the recycled plastics in each piece. I know I said it already, but if your client is interested in one piece of the collection, then you could also upsell opportunities into other pieces. Again, if you do have one speaker, well, yeah. where was I going with that? Well, where you're going is you can <laughs> mix and match and build a specific kit to your client's needs. Yeah. I want to ask you about this. It looks like the ear cup on the headphones is laser engraved. Is that right? Is it that how we're printing these? It's laser engraved. All right. Cool. I like it. I know where you're going. Oh, there we go. The promo Poppy DJ was about to spin, spin another. What? Spin. Oh. Oh, is I that see. that noise canceling? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think it is because I can barely hear you. There we go. There we go. All right. Is that going to do it for the Terratone collection? That's going to do it for the so Terratone collection. Right. There's a lot in there, but I think we got a lot of products that we want to see. I know you're very passionate about the Terratone collection, but I mean, if you want me to, I can. No, sir. I, I want you to do you. I'm, I'm going to do me. I'm going to do me. I appreciate right. you. Oh, yeah. Let's get lit. JK. All right. This is going to be our new fireplace that is collapsible. 
This is not a real fire. I know it looks like it. The real fire are the individuals up here talking to you right now. That's right. But so this does actually pack up and have its own carrying case. And it's made for exactly what you see it for. You put your logs on here, you drop some nice rich brown logs on top, light them on fire. You have the warmth of not only the community that you're supporting around the bonfire and the great conversation and company, but also just that actual lit fire right here. It is mesh stainless steel, so it won't melt. That's been a question that's been coming up right now. So it is actually high quality materials that will sustain the actual flame. So this is a metal mesh. It's not gonna melt, it's gonna stay on here. You can put your rich brown logs on here and they will, they'll, they'll stay lit. Do I do that, is that? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's that was the dab from several years ago. That's not cool. That's, yeah. Sorry. Again, this is a, a product that we're trying to break into, outdoor camping gear. We, other, we have other pieces from the collection we won't show here, but if you're looking for a hammock or any other outdoor gear that's going to look lit, literally, you want to check this out. Well, is this the carrying case? That's the carrying case. I'm this, a, all this folds down into this little bag. That's great. Great portability. Hey, with that. hey, hey. Let's hey, go. Hey, oh. All right. So we heard about more about that fire. Right. I, I don't know if I have any more fire left. You spit hot fire. Oh, oh, wait. Oh. I actually do got more fire. Let's go. <laughs> All right. We just got lit again. This is going to be the Tiki Speaky Extra Freaky. Yeah, you heard that right. No, it's not actually freaky, but this is our Tiki Speaky wireless Bluetooth speaker. It is a 10-watt wireless speaker that is waterproof, made to be outdoors. You see it on the stake. Ah! That's how you get it into the ground. But it does pair together with other like-minded speaker. So you could have two Tiki Speakies together. In terms of putting something in a presentation that your client hasn't seen before, we know that number one question is, what is new? What is new? You have limited options each year. If you want them to walk away feeling like they truly saw something that they haven't seen before, not that same rectangular waterproof speaker that you're used to seeing, the Tiki Speaky definitely checks that box. And it's oh so freaky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, I, don't, I don't know, but you look like I you wanted you, to I something. think you do know, Spencer. Uh, you know? Um, this you said it, I think, but this pairs with another Tiki Speaky, so we can have a we can have a, a party, a, a freaky party, a freaky, honestly, freaky of party. sorts. Yeah, no, All exactly. Right. All right. Um, is there anything else that you want to <laughs> talk about here, new from Oregadio? Um, I have one. I do have one. I, last I have a quick question though, for yeah. those who don't know, like, what are the minimum order quantities on these items? Oh, I'm so glad you asked. Yeah. Are you? Are you I'm really glad? That. I'm so so glad. Oh yeah. They're <laughs> one piece minimums, no setup charges, so you could work right. them in a web store, or if you wanted to entrench yourself into account by working through a program order. It's a nice way to say, hey, we can do one, 10, 20 orders, and then secure that larger order later down the line because you're inside that account. You have your foot in the door. You're talking about strategy, Spencer. Strat. Not only is he a, a promo poppy, but he's also an amazing strategist. Uh, all of <laughs> and, and he has the best sound effects too. Yeah. Um, all right, what other products do we have? Is, is there anything else here in the booth that we have, want to talk about? Yeah, I'm kind of a big Dell. Pickleball, loose connection there. Anyway, so we do have a new pickleball set. If you don't want to play with yourself, like I do, because I don't have too many friends, you have a set of two with our new pickleball set with the carrying case that you do have. Oh, yeah, I missed that. He kind of grabbed my butt on the way in. But this pickleball set is new, one piece minimum. The difference maker here is going to be the laser etch that exposes the wood. This is nice because what you traditionally see in the industry right now is a full color edge to edge. And that has its place with certain clients. We wanted to do something different, which is why we went with the laser edge that exposes the nice wood, gives it a higher quality feel. Secondly, we do have a fire glazed dome on the bottom of the handle as a second decoration method. For all my pickleball players out there, if you have a $100 paddle, you can see that most of those paddles do have a fire glazed dome, fire glazed dome on the bottom which gives it that true traditional retail look that we're all looking for in promo at the end of the day. I think when I'm looking at this, exposing the wood makes a huge impact. I can't tell you how much impact exposing the wood definitely does have. No, on. I mean, it, you could see the, the, the wood grain. It looks like uh, some sort of really expensive, you know, retail item. I love it. Is, and it's got some weight. There you go, Jeff. It could be a weapon. Oh. Good catch. Sorry. That was great. <laughs> Let's go, someone died. <laughs> someone died. <laughs> well, no, they didn't. Oh, um, okay. Uh, so, I mean, that was, listen, do you want questions? Or? We're having fun. Send, listen, this is PPA Expo 2024. We're having a blast, wow. as you can tell. And we love this stuff. Spencer loves this stuff. I love this stuff. This is exciting stuff. And these products were built to excite you and your clients. Um, we're going to wrap up the day. I think I'm excited. Gonna, are you? Yeah, I'm excited uh, and bothered. Good catch. Oh. Uh, 
she missed it. All right, folks. I think this is going to wrap up the day. This is going to wrap up our live stream on Tuesday, January 16th. Be back with us tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Pacific time sharp. We're going to kick the day off with a really great recap. I'm going to walk through and see what the learnings were from our customers. Spencer, what's your what's the top thing you're hearing today? One of the biggest things I'm hearing is it's great that we have our largest collection that we did release, the Ecotech, along with a lot of other items that are sustainability focused. Yes, sustainability, a huge buzzword, but the fact that we have that retail quality married with sustainability just puts us in a different caliber of supplier. I couldn't say it better. That was perfect. We're going to do more of that tomorrow morning. So thanks again to all our friends. Let's see if there's any questions on here. Um, I don't see any more questions for today. If you do, put them in the chat. Email me. Email Spencer. Um, and we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. for the HPG live stream, live from PPA AI Expo 2024. We'll be watching you. Thanks, everybody. They should be watching.